All right, guys, welcome. So it's finally here. We're going to be jumping in and playing some Red Dead Redemption 2. Um, but I had some ideas. We've been throwing this around the community for a while now. This playthrough is going to be not a low honor playthrough. We're going to aim for pretty much a no honor playthrough. So, I mean, we're going to just lowest of the low. But I don't want you guys to take that out of context. I mean, I'm not just going to like randomly be like, senselessly killing people just like to make it like th that's not like what i'm going for but i am going for pretty much any situation we're confronted with we're gonna approach like a straight up bandit savage assassin type just we're, we're not taking no shit from anybody just the lowest of the lowest honor uh possible so it, it's gonna be fun it's gonna be very very savage so know that i'm not making these decisions I, you know some people might get offended by some of the decisions i make or saying that i'm heartless for this that's the whole point of the playthrough all right that's the whole point of the playthrough uh if you guys want to see my high honor playthrough i actually did a full playthrough of rdr2 on the channel already uh approach most situations like a good guy so if you want that you can go check that out but if you want the deep dark savagery uh that this is where this is where it's going to be. So, um, again, thank you, everybody, for coming and hanging out and checking this out. Remember, I don't know how long this series is going to be. Uh, we are. I have to start the game from the very beginning because I lost my save data somehow. I am playing with mods. If you guys are interested what mods are installed, they're in the description below. Uh, we got a ton of mods. A lot of the game is going to be completely different um, than the first time I played it. So, uh yeah, sit back and enjoy. If you guys want more of this, all you got to do is smash that like button. Uh, best way to let me know what you guys want to see more. Uh, if you're new to the channel, consider subscribing. It really, really helps out. And uh, yeah, let's not waste any time. Uh, let me get rid of this real quick. I want to take one second, though, and thank uh, Sunny for the gifted membership before the stream even started. Uh, we got um, Arkaz with the six months and uh, Omnom with the five months. Thank you. Thank you. I'm going to try to avoid. Uh, no, I'm not trying to avoid anything in this playthrough. We're, 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 we're beating them all up. We're shooting them all. All right. Let's do it, guys. Now, um, I, I have about 27 mods installed. I had no conflictions. My game didn't crash. I did run the game for about 10 minutes. Uh, it ran to smooth. I'm not promising you guys the game's not going to crash at some point. So if it does, I'll, I'll address it, try to fix it, and, and move on. But from what I've seen, it was running smooth. The only thing I got to do is turn off the little trainer menu when the game first starts. But uh, other than that, um, it looked good, guys. It looked good. All right, here we go. This is my favorite game of all time, just so you guys know. My number one favorite game of all time. David, thank you for the super chat, brother. Ultimate savagery income. <laughs> hide your grannies, hide your dogs, flying bright. Hey, the thing is, is um, I actually have a dog companion mod. I'm not going to be a savage towards my dog if I decide to get one. I did install the mod, but I don't know if we're actually going to tame a dog. Just because I get set up a lot when it comes to dogs, it's just... All right, guys, I got to, like, get into a mindset to be a savage because it's not who I am by nature, so it's it's going to be tough. Ultimate savagery incoming. Hide yo grannies. Hide yo dogs. Fly in Brian is coming. Oh, well, John, how you doing? All right, here we go. Abigail says he's dying, Dutch. We'll have to stop someplace. Okay. Arthur's out looking. I sent him up ahead. Uh. If we don't stop soon, we'll all be dying. This weather, it's May. I'm just hoping the law got as lost as we did. There. Arthur! Any luck? I found a place where we can get some shelter. Let Davy rest while he, you know, an old man in town. 
abandoned. It ain't far. Come on. Come on. Right there. Yeah. Miss Gaskell, get that fire lit, quick. Miss Jones, bring in whatever blankets we have. Mr. Pearson, see what we've got in terms of food. Davy's dead. There was nothing more you could have done. What are we gonna do? We need supplies. Well, first of all, you're gonna stay here, and you were gonna get yourself warm. Now, I sent John and Mike scouting out ahead. Arthur and I, we're gonna ride out, see if we can find one of them. And this? Just for a short bit. And I don't see what other choice we have. Listen. Listen to me, all of you, for a moment. Now, we've had, well, a bad couple of days. I loved Davy, Jenny. Sean, Mac, they may be okay. We don't know. But we lost some folks. Now, if I could throw myself in the ground, in their stead, I'd do it, gladly. But we are gonna ride out, and we are gonna find some food. Everybody, we're safe now. There ain't nobody following us through a storm like this one. And by the time they get here, well, we're gonna be, we're gonna be long gone. We've been through worse than this before. Mr. Pierce, Miss Grimshaw, I need you to turn this place into a camp. We may be here for a few days. Now, all of you, all of you, Get yourselves warm. Stay strong. He's got a plan. Stay with me. We ain't done yet. Come on, Arthur. All right. We've got some work well, to do. We ain't run into them yet. So they both must have headed down the hill. Sure. Hey, I ain't had time to ask. What really went down back there on that boat? We miss you. That's what happened. Come on. Uh, oh. Hey, you need horses? Oh, yeah. Hey, Mr. Smith, get yourself indoors. You need to rest that hand. I'll live. Get indoors, son. I. We need you strong. Okay. Uh, uh. Man, I forgot Come how good this damn game go. looked, man. Ain't sure what we're gonna find out here, Dutch. We have to try. Stay close. We'll do our best to stick to the trail. This goddamn weather. Been two days or more like this now. Oh, it has to blow over soon. Now, as you guys can see, there's some new icons on the map. Uh, hunger, thirst, uh, having to pee and sleep. here we're gonna have to eat chat uh, just add some immersion to the game too. you know what I mean he's the last one Arthur no more we need to get those people warm and fed at least we don't need to worry about Pinkerton's tailing us in this uh, a couple more days 
We'll be on the other side. You need to help me pick the others back up. You're the only one I can rely on to stay strong right now. Hey, I think I see something up the path. Ah! I think we, get, we should be able to get some food because we're already quite hungry. I think we can get some food Who's in the here? house. Micah. Gentlemen. Found anything? I think so. Found a little homestead down that way. Okay. Anyone home? Sure. Place is blazing with light and noise. Sounded like a party. Let's go see. Follow me. <clears throat> hey, how's him, Davey dude. doing? Well, he didn't make it. Nor did little Jenny. That's too bad. Davey was a real fighter. Both of them calendar boys is. Or <laughs> was. Yeah. And Mac, Sean, we don't know. Quite a business. So the frame rate looks laggy? I'm glad you're I don't know why it looks good on my end. Ask him if he's seen John. Hey, have you seen John, Micah? Didn't see much of anything once this storm. I'm sitting at 50 frames right now, 50 yeah, FPS. Almost 60. Be fine. Things always turn out right for that boy. I hope Mac and Sean are still out there somewhere too. Hey, Arthur, let me take the rear. You move up. Easy. We're the only ones crazy enough to be out in this, Morgan. Yeah, well, don't talk to me about crazy. Oh, so no, glad you're all right. I was worried, Micah. Look, it's all gonna work out, Morgan. We lost a few folks, but that's just how it goes sometimes. Well, I'm glad you're feeling so good about it. Where are all the others? Old mining camp, back up the hill. It ain't much, but shelter. So, this house, you speak to the people there already? No. Like Dutch told us, look, but don't talk to no one. Just following orders, you know me. Okay, let's keep it down now, gentlemen. It's just it is. up ahead. Yeah, guys, um, Easy. I was extremely blown okay. away by the amount of mods they have for let's this game. It's... There. I mean, we got some really cool stuff. You guys are interested in the mod list. It's in the in the description right now. But guys, oh my god, there's some really, really cool stuff that you can do to this game. Uh, but I want to thank everybody for the gifted memberships. I know I missed the membership. Uh, 72 King David with the four months. <clears throat> I appreciate you, brother. Caspi with the 12 months. Army Gale with the gifted. Thank you, guys. Lock away your puppies, Brian, to be a... Nah. We'll see. We'll see how the savage... I mean, I'm going to be a savage, but... All right, here we go. Got to remember how to even play. Uh, Briggs, I appreciate it. I'm glad you're enjoying it, man. And Manu with the membership. Thank you. Welcome to the family. I, I forgot how beautiful this damn game Someone is, man. Is having fun in there. You too. Get yourself out of sight. One lonely man is a lot less intimidating than three nasty looking degenerates. Arthur? In that kind of snow, on the man. I could get down behind that wagon in front. Some nice snow. Alright, let's get in here. As you guys know, the first like hour or so, the game's quite scripted, um, so Hello? it won't be the real free play stuff until after the fact. Excuse me. Hello. Oh, well. Hello, friend. What you want? I am very sorry to disturb you. Uh, my friends and I, well, we got into some trouble up the way, lost in the storm. Ah, uh, gentlemen. We can't help you, Mister. 
I got folks. Arthur. Dying on the trail. Arthur, we got a problem. Oh. <laughs> folks. There's a corpse right here. Now I, I just Arthur, need some. There's a body of food in the wagon. Or something. I hear you. Just keep your eyes on Dutch. Please. I think you should go now, buddy. Now, friend. I ain't asking for much. Please. I am kind of desperate. Hey. I don't believe it. Come here, partner. Come here. It's goddamn Dutch over there. More of them. He's in the Kettleman's slow. Gotta make sure they're all dead, Dutch. What are you doing out there? Yeah, we gotta find some food. Smells like a party in here. Turn the place upside down. Grab as many supplies as you can. We need the essentials. Food, medicine, whiskey. up for the ride back okay so great now like i said uh we're gonna get hungry because we got the hunger and thirst on but we're finding food in here so it's just let me see eat some peaches see if this going all right yep simple as that see there's a big price on oh. como driscoll's head Nearly as big as the one on yours. Wanting Colm dead is about the only thing me and Uncle Sam agree on. Huh. Looks like the poor bastard was married, too. At some point. If we can't eat it or drink it, put it down. Yeah, definitely need dry, all this early warm. game food. We could maybe move the women and Jack down here. Maybe. We'll see how they are when we get back. I don't really want us to split up. Keep searching while I pack these on the horses. Grab anything you think we can use and meet me out here. A lot of loot, man. how to use the like eagle vision or whatever let's get outside Micah Arthur keep looking for stuff Arthur go see if there's anything in that barn Micah you search the cabin see what we missed now this where things might get interesting guys because I do have a melee combat mod in that like changes up the melee combat big time um I'm just at any point waiting for the game to just <gasps> do it like have a hiccup and just crash because of one of the mods I installed we'll see ah, ah. Oh, 
Mr. Shot my cousin. Well, he started it. I'm gonna break your neck. What's going on? Now, this guy just jumped me. Oh, did he now? What's Thank up, bro? You little bastard. Should I kill him? No. Not yet. Find out what they're doing here and where Calm is. Oh, this son of a bitch will talk. Where's Calm, O'Driscoll? With the others. At an old mining camp southwest of here. Near the lake. Yeah, he just spilt the beans. I didn't even have to what punch him in his face. Why are you up here? Uh, we're fixing to rob some train. Gonna blow the tracks. No, I don't know more than that, I swear. <laughs> well, I would say it looks like you have this, Arthur. Do what you want with him. I don't care. But bring that horse when you're done. Oh. I don't know anything else. <laughs> Please. <laughs> Got us a new horse, guys. Is that bastard still in there? He's dealt with. Good. That looks like a decent horse. You should keep him. Tie him up over there, Arthur. Okay, we mean you no harm. Miss, miss. Come on, it'll be okay. We need to get out of here and quick. Come on now. Oh. We had a warm place to stay. You okay, miss? They came three days ago. And my husband, they. Okay. Miss, you are safe now. And you can't stay here. You come with us. Arthur. Miss, it's okay. We're bad men. We ain't them. It's okay. Get on. We'll keep you safe until you figure out what you want to do. What's your name, Miss? Miss. Adler. So I can thank you for the super chat, brother. Sadie Adler. So what's the idea behind Mrs. No Honor? Are you planning on going... Not, not murdering Rampage, it's just... He, a preach, approaching every situation... He was my husband. ...is a pure savage. I, the horses, everybody's... There's, there's no... When it comes to No Honor, there's nobody is safe. So, uh, you know... If I gotta drop somebody's horse to drop them, the horse gotta get dropped. That, that's it. Somebody's coming. Faulty with the 25 months. Thank you so much, like man. It's like Dutch. Hey, everybody, Dutch is back. How'd you get on? Uh, Micah found a homestead, but he weren't the first. Colm O'Driscoll and his scum, they beat us to it. Uh, uh, we found some of them there, but there is more about, apparently. Uh, scouting the train. Thank you. 
That's the last thing we need right now, Dutch. Well, it is what it is. But we found some supplies, some blankets, a little bit of food, and this poor soul, Mrs. Adler, Miss Tilly, Miss Karen, would you warm her up? Give her a drink or something? And Mrs. Adler, it's gonna be okay. You're safe now. They turned her into a widow. Animals. I need some rest. I haven't slept in three days. You're over here. Miss O'Shea will show you the way. Mr. Morgan, we put you in a room over here. Thank you, Miss Grimshaw. Mr. Bell, you're with the fellas over there. What? Now how come Arthur gets a room and I get a bunk bed next to Bill Williamson and a bunch of darkies? Get yourself to bed. Yo, Micah sounded salty. Good. Should have put him outside in the snowbank. He ain't been seen in days. Weather ain't let up. He's strong. And he's smart. Strong, at least. Hello, Arthur. Abigail. Arthur, how you doing? Just fine, Abigail. And you? I need you to... I I'm sorry. I'm sorry to ask, but... It's little John. He's got himself caught into a scrape again. He ain't been seen in two... Two days. Your John will be fine. I mean, he may be as dumb as rocks and as dull as rusted iron, but that ain't changing because he got caught in some snowstorm. At least go take a look. Javier? Yes. Javier, will you ride out with Arthur <clears throat> to take a look for John? <clears throat> You're the two best fit men we've got. Now? She's... We're all... Yeah, we're pretty worried about him. I know. The situation were reversed. And he looked for me. Thank Ooh, you. We got a shotgun. This way. Last I know, John was headed up the river. For all we know, he kept riding north and never looked back. He wouldn't leave. Not like that. Uh, wouldn't be the first time. Let's take a look. Let's hope it ain't more of O'Driscoll's boys. Well, seems somebody left recently. Low honor is gonna be hard for me, Zach. That way. Sure. Well, come on then. Like this playthrough is gonna be painfully difficult for me to pull river. off. Just because I'm God, I'm not buddy. built like that, you know. See, they continue up that way. The tracks lead this way, Arthur. I'm coming, bro. You think it's John? You tell me. These are horse tracks for sure, but could be anyone. Let's just see where they lead. So, you were there, Javier. What really there happened you are. on that boat? Let you run out on me for a second. Like you were saying before, we had the money, it seemed fine, and suddenly they were everywhere. Bounty hunters? No, Pinkertons. It was crazy. Raining bullets. Take it slow. Big ravine here. Dutch killed a girl in a bad way, but it was a bad situation. That ain't like him, though. We continue along the cliff wall here. Davey got shot. Mac and John, both shot too. Sean, we don't even know. 
I'm surprised we escaped at all. By the time you boys showed up from the other side of town, we were only just holding on. Bad business, all right. Damn snow's coming in hard again. We'll lose these tracks if we don't move fast. It's getting narrow here. I forgot how gorgeous this game is, man. It's just so... It's like you get back in it and it's just like, oh, man. Horses are struggling. Yeah, a lot of fresh snow here. I don't know about this, Javier. I mean, we can't follow nothing. Uh, let's push on a little bit. Maybe we'll pick up the trail again. Riding that horse when we left Blackwater. Let's see if he can hear us. Come on, up there. Yeah, we can't play RDR online, especially with mods. Like you can't do it. Um, but Red Dead Online. Um, it's just on PC. It's just plagued with cheaters. It, it's it's un it's unplayable. It's somewhere. I don't think we can go much further on the horses. We'll have to walk from here. I'd grab that shotgun from your horse. Who knows what's up ahead? You know, I never really used the shot sawed off shotgun like at all in my playthroughs. There we go with the horses shitting again. Careful here. You sure about this? Coming from this way. Okay. Mierda, that we're high up here. You're telling me. Help me. Careful. There's a drop here. Watch out here. Watch your head here. Okay, from here. Watch your step. This is real slippery. Stay close to the wall. Up here. Come on. All this freaking brutal right now, man. Hey. Over here. That sounds closer now. Come on. We're coming, John. How you doing? I'm miserable. <laughs> I'm miserable. It's a few days. <laughs> I know. Here, take a drink of that. Thanks. I'm not designed for this snow. Let's keep moving then. Come on. John, where are you?
That's John. We're coming. That was there. What well, not his mom? How he survived like three days out here. Over here. All right. Hot down, Marston. He's down here. That's quite a scratch you got there. Never thought I'd say this, but good to see you, Arthur Morgan. You don't look so good. I don't feel too good, neither. I'm freezing. Don't die just yet, cowboy. Come on, compadre. Well, we can't go back the way we came. Let's try this way. Ain't you a sorry sight? Can't argue with you there. See, I told Dutch you weren't the right man for this. I'm sure you did. You all right? I don't think so. Come on. I'm still we'll trying to build we'll it up out. mentally in my brain how I got to do this, guys. Look up there. Uh, Sucker, I have a 48 inch um, LG Ultra gear. I'll distract him while you get to the horses. Go. Draw them off. All right, John, come on. Let's get you on that horse. We got two shots. Uh, we're getting you out of here. Hey, draw them off us, Arthur. Take them away from us. Draw them back, damn it. Uh, Dustin, sorry I missed that super chat, brother. <laughs> uh, thank you so much, man. I'm doing good. We just got shredded. You see that on the ridge? Perfect. You head for the horses. I'll keep John's friends. Yo, three of them is top, team. guys. All right, John, come on. Let's get you on that horse. We're getting you out of here. Keep them away from us. Stay back. Stay back. Good, Bitch. Good work, Arthur. Okay, let's get going before any more of these bastards show up. to the others yeah. uh, you, you can't skin or do anything until you do that mission with Charles I don't feel too good you'll be fine it's just like a, a dog bite <sighs> I knew a fella got bit by a dog died an hour later you ain't gonna die not yet Tranquilo. You see any more, Arthur? 
Don't think so. Jesus! You still with us, Marston? Just about. You're gonna be okay. We have some shelter now. Thanks for coming for me. Of course. That bullet in Blackwater, now this. You had a hell of a time. And Arthur always says, I'm lucky. None of us are lucky right now. We should ride in the water for a bit. Try to lose a scent. Don't want to leave a trail right back to camp. You know, we're gonna need to come up with a better story for that scar. So, freezing, bleeding, starving? Damn near getting eaten to death ain't good enough for you. Here, let's cross to the left. Yeah, come on. Let's push hard and get back. See those buildings up ahead, John? That's where we camped. Nearly there. Come on! Someone help John down off this horse. Can we get some help here? Guys, holy crap, I appreciate it. We got already, already almost 400 likes on the stream. That's crazy. We need some help. We need some help here. Come on, help him down. You're alive. You're alive. Come on, here we go. Huh? Here we go. Oh. Ah, you oh. careful, idiotas. It's his leg. That's oh, hot. Well, come on, let's get you warm. Thank you. Thank you both. This is a new low, even by your standards. <laughs> Thank you, Arthur. Thank you. You got any other lost maidens need saving? <laughs> Not today. Have you and Dutch talked about how we're gonna get out of this? I was just discussing with Herr Strauss when the weather breaks. I suppose we'll have to keep heading east. East? Into all that? That civilization? I know. The west is where our problems are worse. Come on, Herr Strauss. Let's get warm. Thank you, Mr. Morgan. <laughs> all that civilization? Uh, Assault, thank you for the gifted, brother. I appreciate it, man. We have been running for weeks. We found shelter and been resting here in some old abandoned mining town while we wait the thaw. Hardly the spring I had been hoping for. So what now, Dutch? We get strong, we get warm, and we wait. When the storm breaks, we move. But we're safe here. Warm enough. I guess. No, Dutch always has a plan, doubtful. guys. Not doubtful, just worried. What do you think, Arthur? Well, I wasn't on that boat, so hard to say. But I trust your judgment, Dutch. Always have. Thank you, son. We have been shot at before, Jose. I don't feel that this is honestly anything new. I hope not. We had a bit of bad luck, but then the storm covered our tracks, so now we wait a bit, and we go back to Blackwater, and we get our money, or we get some more money, and we keep heading west. But we're heading east. For now. For now. We got this. We're safe. Stay strong, Jose. Got a plan. He's got a plan. Are you doubt me too? Never. Good. Because you know me, son. I'm just getting started. Once we get some money, well, they... They better send some good men after us because they ain't never going to find us. But we need money. Of course, Dutch. Thank you, son. For your strength. It means a lot to me. Okay, so I gotta figure out how to do the survival menu thing. Um... Remember the oh, there it is. Okay, you gotta be outside. My canteen is empty. 
I wonder if there's a water source nearby where we're at currently. Yeah, actually, yeah, there's a river right down behind us. I want to see if I could, uh, can fill the canteen at the river here. Yep, right there. So you can refill your canteen, you can wash yourself. And you can just straight drink from the water, too. Okay, so our canteen is uh, filled. I'm just going to drink some water right now. All right, so now we're fully... Fully good water-wise. And then... We don't have to pee yet, so we don't have to worry about that. Okay, so we know how to eat, we know how to drink. Uh, yeah, where would I move my camera? There's no other place for me to move it. There's, there's absolutely nothing on this side of the screen anyways. <coughs> We're gonna starve to death up here, Mr. Morgan. Right, We're okay. This. We have a few cans of food and a rabbit. For what, 10, 12 people? When I was in the Navy. I, I do not wish to hear about what you got up to in the Navy, Mr. Pearson. We were stranded at sea for 50 days. And you unfortunately survived. When we ran away from Blackwater, I wasn't able to get supplies in. Well, when government agents are hunting you down, sometimes shopping trips need to be cut short. We'll survive. We always have. And if needs be, we can eat you. You're the fattest. I sent Lenny and Bill hunting, and they found nothing. Well, Lenny's more into book learning than hunting. Bill's a fool. Unless those mountains are full of game that want to read, ain't no wonder they found enough, enough of this. We'll go find something. Come on, Arthur. Wait a second. Hold on. Uh, here. You're gonna need something to eat out there. Assorted salted off. What is that, Starting guys? Would be preferable. Come on, let's go. You can't go hunting. Look at your hand. I can't stay here listening to you two. Look, if this game in those hills, I'll find it. And you can kill it. You need to rest, Charles. You think this is rest? Come along. <coughs> Gross organs? Here, you take this. I can't use it, and you'll have to. Oh, you're joking. Use a gun. And we'll scare off every animal for miles around. You're never too old to learn, I imagine. All right, <clears throat> let's head out. How are you holding up, Charles? Cured organ I'm meat. Okay, apart from this hand. Stupid mistake. Still bad. It'll be fine in a day or two. I just can't pull a bow right now. Oh, I sure hope I can. Never really got the hang of it. You'll be fine. So, you reckon we're gonna find something to kill that ain't no Driscoll? Huh. There's meat up here for sure. Pearson doesn't know what he's talking about. Now the weather's eased off a bit, they'll be needing to feed. We'll head up this way, find some higher ground. Whew. Been a wild few days, all right. That ride north from Blackwater, getting stuck in the storm, bringing John back in. You've had a lot put on you. I wish I could have done more. I didn't mean it like that, just a lot to think back on. I still don't really know what happened on that boat. Me neither. <laughs> well, Javier told me a bit, but... It sure weren't good.
Mr. Adventure, thank you. Thank you for the super chat, man. This game reminded me of how games should look and feel and play as far as overall interaction with other games companies would follow the style. And, and, and Mr. Adventure, and uh, for everybody else that's in the chat, that's why I installed the mods that I did because I kind of wanted, like, the story is great in this game. Um, the immersion activities are great, you know, hunting, fishing. Uh, the side quests are awesome. But outside of that stuff, there really wasn't much to do in the game. Like, after a certain point like all you could do is really do the missions or just kind of walk around looking for random events a lot of the mods that i added give us more things to do like on a day-to-day -day basis we don't want to do main story stuff we can go out bounty hunting we can go do assassination contracts um rob banks like on our own like there's a whole bunch of stuff that we can do uh, buy houses customize your house build things like there's a ton of stuff Let's i added this way keep your eyes peeled for movement The winds died down too. That's good. No wind at all is bad, but if it's too strong, they won't move. Now shh, stay quiet. This game always reminded me of how games should look and feel and play as far as overall hey, interaction. Wish other second. game companies would follow this something. style. I got the mods from Nexus, yeah. Has deer been here recently? How can you tell? How can you not? Let's walk it from here. You're gonna need the bow. Don't leave it on your horse. A gun will scare everything around. Huh? Where? The bow, Arthur. Come on. Did you give him up. All right, let's grab that. Well, bow now. No point setting off without that bow. Keep down. Move quietly and slowly. Have I played the Dark... I've never even heard of those, Dustin. Uh, Darth, so this playthrough here, uh, like I said, uh, there's no so. guarantee this is going to be a full playthrough focus. of the game. Yeah, now we have the Eagle Eye Focus. Um, but this is our Savage No Honor playthrough modded. Um, so it's going to be a lot different than playing the game before. But like I said, we're, there's no guarantee we're going to do the full six chapters of the game again. We'll just kind of all depends on you guys and how much you really want to see. So, but right now we're in the tutorial. There's nothing we can do. You kind of got to play through this. I lost my saved data. So Don't run. relax. You coming a mile off. Oh, my bad, dude. One of the things I love so much in this game is the damn hunting. So good. There's one right there. Shh. Down there. You see him? Oh, I see him. Are you ready with that bow? Aim for their head or neck. We want a good, clean kill. You can pull back quite hard. You'll feel when it's too much. Nice. I don't see if you can get another one. Hit it right in the neck. Got more right over there across the water.
Unlucky. Take your time. Put his head down right as I freaking shot. Well done. I think that's all we can carry. Okay, you pick up one, I'll get the other. You sure your hand's okay? Uh, it'll be fine once I get it on my shoulder. Just like that, guys. Two Bambies down. Head back. All right, so yeah, our water's nice good, work, our food is decent. Should be enough meat here to keep us all fed for a few days. You found him. <laughs> I knew you'd be okay with that bow. It's easier when they ain't shooting back. <laughs> We've seen enough of that. Considering how things were looking a couple of days back. Well, maybe our luck is finally on the turn. Seems to me we should be putting our effort into getting off this mountain now. Soon. People are still weak, and well, you've seen how snowed in those wagons are. They ain't going nowhere until we get some more thaw. Hmm. You're probably right. And even if we do get off here, what then? We still have a big price on our heads. This is a big country. We'll find somewhere to lie low. Dutch and Jose will have a plan. <laughs> there it is. Yeah. You notice how Pearson's had a bottle in his hand ever since we fled Blackwater? We give the camp cook five minutes to grab the essentials and go, and he doesn't even bring a crumb of food. Good that we caught more than one. A lot of mouths to feed. And that girl from the ranch now, too. But... Not sure she'll be eating much. She has a wild look in her eye. You would too. She lost her husband, her home, everything she had. Huh. So what do we do with her? Once we get out of here and we're back on our feet, we'll see. She might have family somewhere. So it was O'Driscoll's you ran into there? Yeah. <laughs> Last thing we was expecting. What is it with the O'Driscoll's? You ain't dealt with them? I suppose. Hell, we ain't run into them much the last six months. I guess because they've been over this way. Yeah. I've heard a lot of talk about them. Well, we've been scrapping over scores what are you for doing? Them years. Uh, careful. Big gang. Nasty sons of bitches. Their leader, Comb, and Dutch go way back. 
And not in a good way. A proper blood feud. So I heard. Watch out. We'll get a grizzly up, up there. Let's see if we can find another way around. No, I'm not just gonna punch people for no reason, Darth. It's not that kind of savage play. Like, like it's gonna have it's gonna have purpose, you know. Stay well back. Spring storms like this are the worst for animals that sleep all winter. Cut up here, off the trail. Yeah, if I just went around just shooting random innocent people, like they would just be dumb, you know what I mean? I really want to make a whole lot of sense. We're, we're going to be a savage. We're going to have no honor, but we're going to do it within, you know, y you'll see. You know what I mean? I right, said, so once the game opens up, we're in free play. You ain't ever talked that much, you and me. How long you been with us now? Five, six months? Something like that. But you didn't expect this. What? Any of this. Blackwater mess. Being up here? Ah, uh, sooner or later, a job's gonna go wrong. Nature of life. I just thought you might have moved on by now. You want me to move on? No. No, not at all. I just... I know you could run it alone, no problem. I did that for a long time. I'm done with it. Always wondering if someone's gonna kill you in your sleep. I still wonder that most nights. <laughs> I reckon you're okay. This suits me. Sure, I could fall in with another gang, but Dutch. You know, Dutch is different. Oh, yes. Dutch is certainly different. He treats me fair. Most of you do. And for a fellow with a black father and an Indian mother, that ain't normally the case. Well, we need you now. More than ever. Good. And how long have you been with these boys? Why ain't you run off? Me? Oh, 20 years, something like that. Since I was a boy. 20 years? Yeah. He taught me to read. John, too. He taught me a few other things, him and Hosea. Huh. I'm sure. Dutch saved me. Saved most of us. That's why we need to stick by him through this. He always sees us right. So, How's that new Nobody horse? wanted Arthur? He's How could right. nobody want Arthur? Like, I'm not even gonna lie. I mean, this might trigger some people. First of all, uh, Small Fry with a 13. Thank you so much, dude. I need one granny punch, one dead dog, one goat. Hey, we'll see. We'll see. Um, but I, I mean, this might trigger some people, but honestly, like, I like Arthur way more than John. Like, I think Arthur is a far better, like, in every category character than John Marston. I appreciate you letting me take Taima the other night. She's a strong one. It's been as hard on the horses as on the rest of us. I don't know what Dutch would do if something happened to the Count. Same with Bill and Brown Jack. He's a drunk, miserable bastard, but... He loves that horse. Huh. I hope they all make it. I tried to ride the count once. Fuck me faster than a bull. Won't take nobody but him. I played Red Dead 1, yeah, yeah. Even with Red Dead 1, all of it, yeah. Arthur's far superior to John, in my opinion. Yeah, we got some I'm food. I'm over here. Brought some food back, boys. See, now with this eating mod on us being hungry and stuff, eating the camp stew every day would be Come a nice on. way to keep our uh, our hunger in uh, check, uh, too. Thank you for showing me how to use the bow properly. I only showed you a little. It takes a lifetime of practice to master. Wait, can you bring up the stream on your thing? Well, well, well! <clears throat> Just drop it down in here.
What a surprise. I find a camp rat loitering around in the kitchen. Is that any way to greet an old friend? I feel like we haven't spoken for days. I do my utmost to avoid you. Why, he loves me, really. It's his sad way of showing affection. No, it isn't. Now shoot, get lost. Uh, well, see you gents later. See, you got on just fine. Charles is a wonder. Have a drink, boys. You earned it. Jesus, what is that? Navy rum, sir. It's the only thing. The only thing. <laughs> Keeps you sane, it does. Yes. Oh. Seems to have done a treat on you. You go rest that hand, Charles. We'll Chris, thank you for the one months. month, but I appreciate you. Might help you. me with the skinning, Mr. Morgan. It's easier if we do it together. Go get to skin you. <coughs> You're always one with the jokes, aren't you? Come on. This really isn't a job for a man with a burnt hand. I'll see you both later. You skin that one, you, you dumped on the floor there. Too bad, Mr. Morgan. Yeah. They always said you were a butcher. You know, you could trade these or sell these in pretty much any town. If you're looking to make a legitimate bit of money, of course. Right now, I'm just looking to get off this mountain alive. Well, if you catch anything else, you bring it to me. Sure. <laughs> Thank you, Mr. Morgan. Heck, Arthur Morgan's first decent bit of hunting after all these years. Yeah. <laughs> Well, we're on the run now. Everyone's got to do their bit to survive. Just make a good stew. Folk need it. It's been a tough few days. <sighs> See, now, my savagery will, will not be aimed towards the gang, though. Um, we're, we're, obviously, they're, they're our brothers in arms. Savagery's going to be aimed at everybody else. Boys, because I thought you liked action. A couple of days on the lam, and you lot have all turned yellow. Apart from you, of course. Shut up, Micah. I ain't never seen so many long faces. Mm. I guess, I guess folks miss them. That fell. But when I fall, I don't want no fuss. When you fall, there'll be a party. <laughs> <laughs> Probably. <laughs> Probably. Uh -huh. Funny, huh? Sure. <laughs> I don't feel like being laughed at by the likes of you two. Stop it! Now! You fools punching each other when Como Driscoll's needing punching hard! You want to sit around waiting for him to come find us? All of you, we got work to do. Come on. Are you sure about this, Dutch? Yes. Folks been through a lot recently. We hardly back on our feet yet. And the last thing we need is to get bushwhacked by Como O'Driscoll. Let's go. I know you hate him, Dutch. He's here for us. I doubt that. No, you're just doubting me. I would never doubt you, Dutch. You... You always said revenge is a luxury we can't afford. This is the right call, Arthur. Take this. And this is about more than revenge for business long ago. They were talking about trains and detonators here. Cole always had good information. Come on. And you think now is the right time to hit a train? Now you might fancy living on deer piss and rabbit shit. <laughs> I'm getting too old for that life. Mr. Matthews, Mr. Smith, Mr. Pearson. Would you please look after the place? There are O'Driscolls about. Yeah! Mr. Adventure with the Super Chat. Nearly 1K. What's the highest number I've ever had on a live stream? 2,600 right, yeah. live viewers. He said, follow the main trail southwest. The camp near some lake. Okay, let's go find these bastards before they find us and rob this score they're planning. All right, so we just got uh, two new weapons. I do need to swap out back to my revolver. No, nah, maybe we could keep the shotgun. I don't know. We'll see. Uh, Jake Miller with the membership, brother. Thank you so much. Welcome to the family. Oh. I can tell 
The only fools out here are us and them. They must be this way. You good, Dutch? Of course. Listen. I know you don't think much of my ideas recently, but this is the right move. Okay. You know I got your back. I learned a long time ago that you hit Como Driscoll. Wait for him, and people you love will die. This feud between you and him needs to be put to rest, one way or another. <laughs> it will be. Some things I can forgive, others I can forget. What he did to Hannibal, I can't do neither. You killed his brother, Dutch. Yes, I did. And I hope the bastards will be reunited soon enough. That's how this will end. Damn right, boss. See that smoke? Let's cut up here and take a look. They said it was near the lake, so we must be close. All right, let's see how this yeah. fight goes. Uh, so now it's going to be our first real big, big fight. Uh, I got a lot of combat mods installed that make the enemy AI react and get shot and bleed Hold out. And do a bunch of crazy stuff, so it's going to be cool to see All how right, this goes. Yeah. This is it. Are we goddamn ready? Ready, ready Dutch. Good. Now... Mr. Morgan and I, we're gonna head up here a little, see if we can't get a sense of the layout of the camp. Mr. Williamson, Mr. Bell, you two take up a hidden position just outside the camp. Mr. Summers, Mr. Escuela, you two hold position here. Let's go. Let me... Oh. A nuclear sim with the gifted. Thank you so much. Okay, so I can't take my weapons now. I'll have to do it after. I appreciate it. Unbroken, it's going good. There they are. That's definitely them. Home? I think so. Yeah, that's him. See, I need to be a bigger savage than Colm. Who's he talking to? He don't seem very happy. No. They leaving? Seem to be. Should we go get them? No. Cone can wait. Best to get some of them out of there. And much less fun to rob him and his score if he never finds out about it. Come on, let's get down there. Unbroken says, my second playthrough of this game, I almost did low honor, but I couldn't. See, guys, I have no Don't choice. To grab that rifle from your horse. I have no choice. I have to do it. No honor. All right. You boys be ready to pick as, them off from up there. As you painful as it's going to be. All right. So we're going to go ahead and grab our rifle and I'll keep the. I'll keep the sawn off. Screw it. Good. Come on, let's go. Seems easiest to take the same path down as Bill and Micah. Like you said, revenge is a luxury we can't afford. Yeah, just wasn't sure you agreed with me. Arthur. Arthur, have you completely lost faith in me? Our needs right now are supplies, equipment, and a way out of here. Everything else, including Calm, can wait. Okay. There's enough of those bastards down there to deal with as it is. Now, come on. Well, there's some there's some good deeds that the game 
like forces you to do toward especially towards the end with arthur's redemption arc um so there's there's nothing you can really do in that sense Watch out. This bit steep. I want to thank you guys. We're a little over an hour into the stream, and already we have over 500 Maybe likes on. That's absolutely that's, that's, that, that's They're huge. They're going to be gunning for you. They ain't got me yet. No, but the way our luck's been running, hush. Let's just get down there first. Down through these trees, quick. Hey, anybody see Liam? Think hunting with it's gonna be a good gunfight. What's the plan, Dutch? Ready for this job to be done. So, what are we doing, Dutch? I can take this if you want. Just make the call. You want to take the lead? Go. What the hell is he doing? God damn it! All right, uh, boys, kill these sons of bitches! Kill every last one of these bastards! Let's go! Remember, this thing's not a damn sniper rifle. not. Colm doesn't give a damn about his men. All he cares about is numbers. If you can shoot a gun and ride a horse and kill without thought, you're in.
Got a Lancaster. Oh shit! Look out! More of the bastards coming out of the trees! This will be a better rifle to fight with. Oh shit! <laughs> oh shit! I pushed forward way too hard. Heads up, boys! We got more coming in from the forest! Damn it, I lost my Lancaster. That damage overhaul, that shit is no joke. It even, because it, it, it makes it so the enemies actually do more damage to me, too. And, obviously, Dutch. <laughs> right, we gotta be, we gotta be more aggressive. Oh shit! Look out! More of the bastards coming out of the trees! A gun here, I'm gonna grab real quick. Shit, there's a lot of them. What do you think, Arthur? Hold ground here, or go after them. I say we go at the bastards. No, I didn't want to. Come on, man. Everyone with me. Let's get into that forest and clear them out. Much better angle now. All these worn weapons that you pick up off the enemies. I don't know if you can keep those. Alright, let's loot these bodies. Uh, and if you guys are wondering what mods I have, they're all listed in the description. I got the whole list of uh, mods in the description. 
Send it happy birthday. Alright, getting some good stuff, man. Some good starter cash. Uh, so RDR2 Online is the the reason why I don't play it is because it's it, it's I can't dodge the modders, especially being on stream. Uh, I just get stream sniped, and we just get plagued with modders. So. Uh, because unlike GTA where I can do like a uh, invite only lobbies, you can't do that in RDR online. So that's why we, we just can't do it. If you're not a streamer, you might be able to get away with it because people aren't going to be targeting you. But, you know, as soon as I open the stream up, you know, the chances of somebody who mods seeing me play. Um, and being like, hey, I want to go fuck with this dude. is just extremely high. Yeah, I actually might swap this. Yeah, 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 I'm gonna do that. Uh, Wiro is a physics mod. It's for the ragdolls physics. You'll see the enemies, like, their body will move in ragdolly ways. We don't have time to mess around. I'm not messing around, dude. I'm looting. We're waiting on you, Arthur. I hope you're having a great day today, Dustin. Uh, Separate fight, Leoric. How you doing, brother? <laughs> Kill Dutch to run the gang ourselves. There's actually a mod where you can do your own, make your own gang in single player. Legit, you can have your own camp and everything. Good work, boys. Now, let's tear this place apart. <clears throat> Bill, you go search that wagon there. Mike, search that building. Arthur, you take that building to the left. All right, man, quick. Find those detonators, explosives, anything you can. Let's go. Well, types of goodies here we can take. Some food in us, so I wonder what the. Okay, yeah, we're good. Yeah, it definitely takes a little while to start this game. Um, the uh, the intro here is quite long. There's mods where you can skip it, but I didn't want to mess around with that. So, plus I needed time to get warm back up and learn the controls and. Stuff like that, so I don't I don't mind it. Plus, it's my favorite game, so I, I love the story. Here, this looks good. What do you think, Bill? Well, looks fine. <laughs> Smells good. Come on. Did we get everything? I think so, boss. The goat Found of this chips. On one of them. Thank you. This I don't is know. Perfect. I'm not really a chip person. Oh yeah, interesting. This is something about the train they was going to rob. A Mr. Leviticus Cornwall. Mount back up. Let's keep moving. All right. Let's get out of here. Proud of you. Boys, all of you. Not a man down. Good work, fellas. Not bad for some starving down and outs. They can pummel us as hard as they like, but we will always get back up and fight. 
Outlaws. The Loot King is back. The best game. Hope to see full John play trial. Mouse, thank you so Morris much, brother. And Sean back riding with us, and I believe, I know, they will all be back. Well, you didn't get combed, but this head will hurt him a lot more than any bullet in the head. Especially when we rob this train, too. <laughs> yeah, I guess we'll see about that. Oh, indeed we will. You know, but... he'll come after us. Oh, of course he will, just like all the rest. But we're gonna stay a step ahead of them. Make sure we always know where they are before they know where we are. We allowed ourselves to get a step behind in Blackwater. That won't happen again. Most I appreciate you, dude, man. Yeah, this is my favorite game of all time. So, uh, like I said, depending on how the length of this playthrough will just depend on you guys and you know how much right. you're enjoying it. Dig in, fellas. Let's make some ground. And Dustin, is it Ura or Hua? Uh, it depends on what branch of the military you're talking about. The Marine Corps says Ura, Ura or Ur, or Yet, um, and the Army says Hua. I think the Navy or something hey. says. Ya or fella? something like that. I don't, I don't know. Camp with Cone? Leave him to me. All right, we're heading back. Just bring him back alive. He could be useful. Okay, you got it. Yeah. Okay, so we got to get the lasso. Well, I haven't lassoed somebody in a long time. We're going to have to get good at this, right? Where are you going? You're coming with me. Just let me go. Come on. Let's rob him first. Come on. I, I, I'm nobody, mister. Mm-hmm. Oh, God, no. Look at the floor for a bit. <laughs> What's your name, boy? I don't know. You don't know your name? It's Kieran. Kieran what? Duffy. Kieran Duffy. Well, I ain't gonna lie to you. This is a real bad day for you, Kieran Duffy. Where are you taking me? Somewhere you ain't gonna like. Why? What are you gonna do to me? Some fan you ain't gonna like. So I'd advise you to save your breath for screaming. No, please. Yeah, my, my goal is this playthrough, guys. We're going to rob everybody. Like, we're going to just be robbing people left and right. Make good money. Please, mister. Let me go. I'll disappear. I'll go to Mexico. You better shut your mouth, you little shit, or I will shut it for you. Oh, God, please, no. Oh, I think I'm gonna puke. Mr. Adventure with the Super die, Chat. Mr. This game is a time and classic. You Thank you for streaming it. No problem, man. It definitely I is. break every bone in your body. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Okay. Not one more goddamn word. Am I clear? Okay, okay. That's two bones right there. George with the super chat. Gotta find a ski mask and black air force. Here what? we are, you sack of shit. Let's introduce you to the boys. To the boys. Don't hurt me, please. Oh, don't worry. They're real nice. Huh. You found a little shit, did you? Yep. <laughs> I got him. Very good. Welcome to your new home. Hope you're real happy here. <sighs> you want me to make him talk? Oh, no. Now all we'll get is lies. Uncle, Mr. Williamson, tie this maggot up someplace safe. 
We get them hungry first. I got a saying, my friend. We shoot fellas as need shooting, save fellas as need saving, and feed them as need feeding. We are gonna find out what you need. I can't believe it! An O'Driscoll in my camp! No, I ain't an O'Driscoll, mister! I, I hate that fella! Oh, whatever you say, son. Well done, Arthur. I'm just sorry we missed out on Cole. Oh, there's time enough for that. Now, I gotta figure out if we can hit that train. Okay. Expander, thank you for the five gifted, brother. <laughs> I appreciate you, man. All right, guys, we're getting close. Getting close to the, the, the free roam. It's been a bad few weeks, but Dutch being Dutch, he is busy making plans and Dutch being Dutch, those plans involve robbery and dreams. Well, I thought you was reading him his last rites. Now I see you're introducing him to your other passion. I'll mind you to show me some respect, Mr. Morgan. Mind away, Reverend. You still here then? I owe you. Yeah. Go upstairs. And you'll pay me. But for the moment, just rest. Arthur. I think it's time for the train. You want me to come? Of course I do, but look at you. I was always ugly, Dutch. It's just a scratch. Don't lie still, son. Hello, Abigail. Dutch? Jackie. The boy wanted to see you, John. He's seen me now. Or what's left of me. What about you? Guess I was hoping to see a corpse. <laughs> Bide your time. You'll see plenty of them. You're a rotten man, John Marston. He is an idiot, Abigail. We all know it. Now, railway men. Bill! Now, you ride ahead and set the charge at the water tower just before the tunnel. Ain't a problem. Why are we doing this? Weather's breaking. We could leave. I, I thought we was lying low. Yeah, come on. What do you want from me, Hosea? I just don't want any more folks to die, Dutch. We're living, Hosea. We're living. Look at me. We're living. Even you. But we need money. Everything we have is in Blackwater. You fancy heading back there? No. Listen, Dutch, I ain't trying to undermine you. I just... I just want to stick to the plan, which was to lie low, then head back out west. Now, suddenly we're about to rob a train. What choice have we got? Leviticus Cornwall's no joke, Dutch. Well, who is Leviticus Cornwall? You know, he's a big railway magnet, sugar dealer, oil man. Well, how good for him. Sounds like he has more than enough to share. Dutch! Gentlemen, it is time to make something of ourselves. Get your horses ready. We have a train to rob! All right! We're moving out! Follow me! Bandito time, guys! Okay, gentlemen, listen up, all of you. According to the information so kindly provided to us by the O'Driscoll, the train will be coming north from Big Valley. Hey, can't you ride, damn it? Oh, yeah, I'm pushing me all over the place. Off after it crosses the border into the Grizzlies. There's a raised spot there that should give us good vantage. Charles, you'll keep lookout for any outriders. How's that hand, by the way? I'll be fine. Good. I'll take the driver and engineer, then run point. Lenny and Javier? You two take the front cars, deal with any guards. Arthur and Micah, you head straight for the back. That's what we're after. Mr. Cornwall's private car. You and me, Morgan. Great. Have you got a problem with that? Not if you keep your head for once. You worry about yourself, huh? Enough! After Bill blows the tracks, we're gonna need to move fast. Is everyone clear on what they're doing? Yep, Crystal. Yes, boss. Good. Now come on. Let's ride. I 
I also installed a mod, guys, called Jobs. It's where you can go and, like, literally do real jobs and make money. Um, the only problem with it, though, is it's not really... doesn't really match up with low honor, so... I don't know. Maybe we'll have to check that out at another time, but... It sounded cool, so I added it just to showcase it if any of you guys are interested. Yeah, there's all types of shit you can go do, like real jobs. Out of the snow, finally. Feels good, doesn't it? But we need to get this done fast. Now it's thawing before anyone gets up here after us. Oh, look at you boys. See? This is what I call a crew. Micah Bell, Charles Smith, Arthur Morgan, Javier Squampeasy. Micah Bell, Charles Smith, Arthur Morgan, Javier Escuela, and what about young Lenny here? Always the first man on his horse. Just happy we're back at him, Dutch. You sure you're ready for this, kid? Of course I'm ready. How come Micah Bell had to get said first? Keep your eyes sharp. That goes for all of you. No mistakes. Not again. So we do this. Then we go back to Blackwater to collect. How many times are you gonna ask the same question, Micah? That's a lot of damn money to leave sitting for too long. It would be crazy to go back there now. The place will be swarming with Pinkertons. We go back when I say we go back. And that's the end of it. There's a water tower. Hold up here on the ridge. Is Bill there? Yeah. You want to head down? See how he's getting on? Okay. Oh. Yeah. How you getting on? Yeah. I'm okay. You sure? Of course. Can I help a little? All right. Go ahead and set up the detonator by those rocks over there. Okay, sure. Now just unspool the wire and then attach it to said detonator. There shouldn't be any lag. Like I said, it doesn't look like it's lagging on my end. Yeah, and even when I look at Crystal's computer on uh, over there, it looks good. Am I going to finish the game? It all just depends, Ali. I I've already played and finished this game on the channel before. Um, okay. This is just a different style playthrough. Uh, right. So depending, uh, th that the length be. of this playthrough just depends you on you guys. To the others. I got it from here. Remember the plan, all of you. Remember no the plan. Mistakes. What's going on? He says all fine. We'll soon find out. Everything okay? I think so. Okay, cover your faces. Train should be here any minute now. Ah, oh, yeah. Item meal. Bandana time, baby. Gentlemen, it's time. Good luck, all of you. You all know what to do. Here we go. Ah. Shit, no, what? God! Oh, you have got to be kidding me. Where did you find? More. You said it was fine. So it's my fault. Come on! You're pathetic. You know that? Uh, shit, and I left my damn good guns on the, the horse. Here we 
go! Here we go! Yo, they had me pinned down pretty damn good there, man. Yo, they do some fucking damage, man, with that mod. Shit, more guards coming out of that train car. There better be some money at the end of this. All these bastards must be guarding something. We need the car at the back, right? Yep, yeah, he's pushing on me. Still okay? Need some heals in. I think so. Damn, he's got an arm! Who is this guy? Doing good, kid. Shoot him! Where the hell are the others? I don't know. Oh, shit. Look, they're coming out of that last car. We're gonna get out of this. Oh, I know we are. Hey! There's the other boy! Move it, Arthur! You're not getting out of here alive. Come on! Clean this up, boys! I'll kill every last one of you! Good shoot, kid! I can see now why the old Triscoll's brought so many boys up here for this. Get over here. You two all right? Yes, let's get the money and go. We got some fellas holed up in this last car. 
Ah, shit. What are you boys planning on doing in there? Listen to me. We don't want to kill any of you. Any more of you. <laughs> I give you my word, but trust me, we will. I work for Leviticus Corps. Come on, boys. We got our orders. Okay. You asked for it. We ain't Five, opening this door. Four. Three, two, one. Seems our friends have gone deaf. Wake them up a little. Mr. Williamson, give Mr. Morgan and Mr. Smith some dynamite. You two boys, go blow that door open. Thanks, Bill. Where the hell now, my hat, don't chat? Too much to us, but you boys in there might want to take a step back. Seems good enough. Here we go. Now light the fuse. Unless you got a death wish, I'd step back, fellas. All right, come on. Just walk on out here. <laughs> we don't want to kill you. My, oh We just my. want to rob your boss. Get on up there. Search that train. <laughs> of course, Micah had to be in there first. Look at this place. <laughs> it's like a palace. Well, now I've seen everything. Oh, you two got the safe? I'll search the rest. Oh, yes. Should be easy as cake. <sighs> What's your name? You're just gonna stand there, kid. Pour me some brandy, will ya? I'm parched. Shut up. Me and Arthur did all the work. Yeah, kid did good. Didn't see you rushing to jump on that train. He's keen. I'll give you that. Okay. We're pulling the cigars. Let's see if we can get this open. Come on. Come on. Get in there. Ha. Ah. There. See? That's how it's done. Shit. It's just a pile of papers. Bond? I don't think so. Here. Make yourself useful. At least we all know you can read. <sighs> Give me those. Railroad contracts, invoices, blah, blah, blah. Mm, you got something. anything? Not really. Sugar imports from the Spanish West Indies. A lot of sugar. Some fancy new boaties. I think I got them. Nice. Well, thank God. Come on. <clears throat> <sighs> Got some bonds, baby. What did you find? These. Mike, bonds. hey, Jory, and thank you for the super chat. Mike, oh, excited for sure. Starfield on the 6th of September. I'm playing on the first, we man. Sell these pretty easily. Well done. Jory, and I'm so hey, excited, man. Get rid of all of this. Jay, for the two uh, months, thank you so much. Get out of here. What about them? Shaz Shazad, how you I doing? <laughs> it's up to you. Kill them, leave them here, take them with you on the train. Just make sure they don't send no folk after us. Okay. See you back at camp. When you get back, we'll be moving on. The rest of you, let's ride. Okay, get on the train. Quick. Stop! Please! No! Are you insane? This.
Lost my hat, guys. I think. Can't you get your hat back from your horse? Maybe not. I think I lost it in the fight when uh, I was fist fighting that engineer. The only reason why I shot him was because there was three of them, and I didn't want to—I didn't want to have to chase him. I didn't want to have to chase him around. So, well, we're gonna definitely have some knife kills. The knife—the knife is something I'm gonna try to get good with. Uh, is that going to be public or exclusive members only because uh is what going to be uh exclusive i don't really do any exclusive paygate content on my channel um just because i don't feel like it's right um you know how the world is man you know people some people just don't have the money you know even two dollars which is totally understandable um and i would never want any of my content or anything on my channel to be uh, pay gated. Uh, I, I, I do want to do more for my members, but not at the expense of my longtime viewers that who just aren't in a situation where they can financially support me, um, in that way. So that you'll never really see me pay gate anything on the, on the channel. Um, but when it comes, if you're talking about Starfield period, um, like that is going to, yeah, that's just going to be a channel. I game I play on the channel. So where the hell we gotta go? Oh, we just got. Oh yeah, we gotta go send the train off, all right? Now I'm not saying I can't have members only content, but something like Starfield, I wouldn't do that. it is I'm excited guys it's, we're about to hit that uh that open world oh, for Lord's sake put that book away and go help oh, Mary Beth. Lenny of course I remember so Lenny you're now this hellhole we're gonna try weather seems stable and we just robbed the Leviticus Cornwall train we got money in our pockets. The worst is behind us, gentlemen. So the question is, where now? I know this country a little. I told you, we should set up camp in Horseshoe Overlook near Valentine. We'll be able to hide out there no problem, as long as we keep our noses clean. <laughs> well, then let's go. Clean noses and everything else. Arthur, you're in that one. Bring Hosea. I know you two like to talk about the good old days and what's gone wrong with old Dutch. And I want to thank you all. Uh, we got already almost 800 likes on this stream. Uh, you guys are phenomenal. I appreciate the support. I hope you guys, you know, are enjoying this. I know it's just the intro. You can't really do much. Uh, but once we get into the free room, it's going to open up a bit. sad though to see like where the gang started to think like where it ended you know
Micah, get over here! Yes, boss. You two ride up ahead, make sure there's no surprises. We've had enough of those. Me? With the boy? Just go. Come on, kid. You can buy me a whiskey. See the wheel goes sus right there. You gotta keep us moving, but calm. Ah, shit. Okay, let's take a look. What do you mean take a look? Right the whole there. wheel fell off. Look all right. <laughs> well, what's going on? Ah, I broke the goddamn wheel. All right, let's get it fixed. You need help? I reckon we can handle it. All right, Charles, you and me hold the thing up while you try and put the wheel back on, Arthur. You still strong enough to hold up a wagon? Shut up. I'm just saying. Well, say less. Pick the wheel up. Man, they make the construction of these seem pretty... Pretty easy, simple. Nearly there. There. See? You ain't so useless after all. <laughs> Not quite. What do you think? If they wanted trouble, we wouldn't have seen them. Poor bastards. We really screwed them over down here. Come on, let's not push our luck. What happened? Well, get in. I'll tell you. Not too far now. Stay on this trail. We'll follow the river, then cut left inland. Yep. So, yes. The Indians in these parts got sold a very raw deal. This is the heartlands we're going to. Good farming and grazing country, they lost it all. Stolen clean away from them it was, every blade of grass. Killed or herded up to the reservations in the middle of nowhere. And how's that different from anywhere else? Well, maybe it's not. I just heard some of the army out here was particularly uh, unpleasant about it. Unpleasant? How do you rob and kill people pleasantly? We don't, in spite of Duchess' talk. I fear I was perhaps trying to simplify something more complicated for the benefit of our block-headed driver here. Hey, don't blame it on me. Never forget, this here's a con man, Charles, born and bred. Just because it sounds fancy don't mean he knows a damn thing about what he's talking about. Yeah. So, what happened to your tribe? I don't even know if I have one. At least, not that I can remember. Oh, shit, I didn't My know about that. That's cool. Man. He told me he lived with our people for a while. A number of free men did. But when we were forced to move from our lands, the three of us fled. Am I po uh, excited for the possible the RDR remaster? Oh, of course, that'd be dope as hell. Life I've been on the run. Yes, I appreciate the tip, brother. A couple years later, some soldiers captured my mother. Took her somewhere. We never saw her again. Fort Solace. I gotta look into that around. game. Uh, people keep bringing it up. I, I gotta man. check that one Drink out. Had a mean hold on him. Around 13, I just took off on my own. That was about the age we found young Arthur here. Maybe a little older. A wilder delinquent you never did see. But he learned fast. Not as fast as Marston, apparently. Wait. I don't understand. What's the problem between you two? Arthur? Yeah, it's a long story. Yeah. We still heading the right way? That depends. 
Are we still heading west in search of fortune and repose in virgin forests as we planned? No. Are we heading in the correct direction on our desperate escape from the law eastwards down the mountains? Yes, I believe so. You know this area? A little. I've been through a couple of times. There's a livestock town not too far from here called Valentine. Cowboys, outlaws, working girls, our kind of place. Driscoll's? Probably them too. Pinkertons? Let's hope not. And this place we're going. Wait, but what's it called again? Horseshoe Overlook. It's a good place to lie low? It'll do for now. And how low do you think Dutch is really going to lie? <laughs> it's just, you know, maybe it's me who's changed, not him, but we kept telling him that ferry job didn't feel right. You and me had a real lead in Blackwater that could have worked out. Maybe. It just isn't like Dutch to lose his head like that. Things go wrong sometimes. People die. It's the way it is. Always has been. Me, you, Dutch. We've all been in this line of work a long time. And we're still here, so... Well, I figure we must have got it right a hell of a lot more than we got it wrong. There it is. Pick Rice, and thank you for the five gifted, brother. How you doing today? What are you working on there, anyway? Just some yarrow and ginseng. Good for the health. Better than that stuff you buy in the store. Yeah, you can have all this. I'm at the point where I can do it with my eyes closed. Oh, okay. Thank you. Yeah. Yeah, I gotta get, we're gonna have to definitely heal more in this playthrough, I can already tell. Just at the rate we've been getting shot, <laughs> it hurts. There you are, brother. Head in there, follow the track for a bit. Thanks. Man, I can barely see him. He was hey, camouflaged pretty good. This is the Savage playthrough, yeah. Okay, let's go. Oh, yeah, I Any served in Iraq and Afghanistan, here, uh, Red Predator. Oh. Went well. This is a good spot. Excellent. I think this will work for us, Arthur. For now, anyway. Here we are, gentlemen. Home sweet home. Here we go. You weren't wrong, Jose. This place Here we is are. perfect. I hope so. Gentlemen, we have survived. For now. Now it is time to prosper. Arthur and I were about to prosper in Blackwater. We were on to something big. Then Micah got you all excited about that ferry, and here we are. We have all made mistakes over the years, Hosea. Every last one of us. But I kept us together. Kept us alive. Kept the nooses off our neck. I guess I'm just worried. I ain't got that long, Dutch. I, I want folks safe before I go. Me too. And now we are stuck. East of the Grizzlies and out of money, and a long way from a dream of virgin land in the West. I know, my brother, but we are safe. We make a bit of money here, then we move again, head out around them, be west of Uncle Sam, in a few months, buy some land. I hope so. <laughs> Would you just look around you? This world has its consolations. <laughs> Gentlemen. I'm going to head into the local town and, uh, you know, see if I can strike up a little business. Of course, Herr Strauss. I prefer robbing banks to usury. Seems more dignified somehow. Now, everyone, put your tools down for a moment. Come on, gather around. Quickly now. And with 24, I know two that things years, have man. Been tough, but we are safe now, and we are far too poor. So it is time for everyone 
to get to work. Get to work, but stay out of trouble. Remember, we are itinerant workers. Laid off when they shut down our factory to the north. Now get out there and see what you can find. Uncle, Reverend Swanson, no more passengers. <laughs> it is time for everyone to earn their keep. There is a town a little way down the track named of Valentine. Livestock town, all mud and morons, if I remember right. That seems a decent place to start. And, uh, we need food. Real food. That means every day. One of you. And remember, whatever it is that you find, the camp gets its slice. Now be sensible out there. Now the girls have your tent ready, Mr. Morgan. Come with me. You two will be ready shortly. We put you over here. I'm sure everything will be fine, Miss Grimshaw. It should be. Most of your stuff from Blackwater got saved. Everything apart from my money. Oh, don't remind me. Well, we can always make more money. We're gonna have to. Miss Jackson, I've seen shit with more common sense than you. Do it properly. There it is. Uh, I get about 60 frames. Yeah, 60 frames. I haven't checked my uh, uh, graphic settings, actually. I don't know what camp I like more, this one or the next one. I, I do, I do kind of like this camp a lot, though. I installed mine uh, manually, Alexis. Got off the mountain, rode east into some pretty enough country called the Heartlands. Ain't been this far east in many a year. Dutch seems a little better. His eyes are sparkling once more. And I can see he's thinking a little clearer. I think we all feel a little happier. Spot of black water and that whole mess. Arthur? Jose? Oh. <laughs> Quite a day. Let's hope so. There's a bunch of the boys already in Valentine. Bill, Charles, and Javier. And Swanson found something down at the train station by the lake, apparently. And Strauss came back with that creepy little smile on his face. I'm sure there's a whole list of unfortunates he's forced money upon. <laughs> Thank you. And you? I'm gonna read a book. <laughs> uh, Shiro, thank you, thank you for the gift, and I appreciate it. Yes. All right. So now we are technically in free mode so let's uh what if the map is still doing that little weird buggy thing that it was doing my first time i played this game um yeah we'll head into valentine I want to sit check because I have a mod that adds like bounties and stuff that we can do all the time. So we're just going to kind of roll in. I want to see how if some how some of these mods and stuff are working. Oh, Arthur, my boy, my dear boy. Start making some on? money. Nothing, nothing at all. For the first time in weeks, nothing. We're free. We're free to plan our own futures once more. I hope so, Dutch. You kept the faith, Arthur. You always kept it. And I ain't losing it now. All right, so let me see. What what, what do we got for guns? Because uh, the Cattleman's Revolver that you start with... What do you think of this place, Susan? An improvement on the last, that's for sure. Well, that ain't too hard. Uh, yeah, the Cattleman's you start out with, it, it shoots really, really slow. I think it's the, you have to literally cock the hammer every single shot to recock it. Uh, let's take a stroll over to Valentine. Okay, 
Okay, so I still was able to keep my other guns too. I'm not gonna lie guys it is so good to be back like so good to be back um so yeah my favorite gun I was using uh the the like regular pistols I it might have been like the 1899 are those I don't old? think you should just be wandering around here friend you really shouldn't rile me ain't wise. That's it! There'll be nothing! Come on! Well, there, there it is, guys. It sent you straight to heaven, first class. Well, now we all understand how dangerous the NPCs are. Got to make sure I approach these situations with some, uh, with some realism. and they're throwing out them threats and I'm like the life of a savage isn't easy, easy guys is it So this is one of those the, one of those bounties. Damn, that's a quick seventy bucks right there. I can see it from here. Ernest Collins. Capture dead or alive. Uh, he's up here. All right, easy way to get some some quick starter cash, Come guys. On, yeah, our horse needs to get brushed real quick. Hold on. Oh, I don't have a, I don't own a horse brush yet. What I gotta remember how to do is the, the quick draw. I think you held that. Bay Bank, yep. I don't remember how to fire from the hip. That's what I was trying to figure out right now. Like how to just fire from the hip, but I don't know what button it is. Yeah. 
Well, I'm on mouse and keyboard, so I don't know if it's different. I do got the gun tricks mod. I don't know how to use it though yet. We're, we're still, I still got to figure out how to even use it. Does anybody know on PC how you, how you. So when I hit the shoot one, he just does that. <laughs> Let me I don't, I don't know what, I don't know what, em oh, oh, I'll check it here in a sec. All right, we're trying to see. If uh, so you to aim in the air. I'll go weapon sights, aim, attack, obviously it's just left click. Dead eye, reload. Melee grapple. Oh, we're probably just going to have to play around with it. Right and left click at the same time. So he just pulls the gun out when you do that. Huh. That's all good. We'll figure it out. Fine morning, partner. Oh, you have to have a pistol equipped? Maybe that's why it won't do it, because I have... I had the shotgun. But can you not fire the shotgun from the hip or something? Okay. So yeah, we kind of aim. All right, all right, I got it. I guess I could do the same thing with the shotgun. Double tap holster button for gun tricks. Oh, I just. pretty cool that's pretty cool dude all right let's get out right, let's... Yeah. now we're a real cowboy All right, so we're going to hunt a bounty real quick. We're trying to get some quick, easy money. 
Now, I'm sitting here thinking, we get more money, Ivis. I don't know, do we get the same amount of money or more money dead or alive? But then I'm like, in a true savage playthrough, would you bring them back alive? Easy. Got yeah. a train coming. Yep, we're good. Body might have same reward, dead or alive. Alright, say less. Yep. Targets in this area somewhere. Yeah. I mean, that was on me for not even paying attention, but yo, we can't, you can't play any games, guys. With our health being so low right now, until we upgrade our health, yo, we're, we're like super squishy. Damn, so does that mean I lost that contract? Gotta make sure that we have, yeah, one of these. Have our health fortified. <laughs> that was pretty quick, man. I like the knife takedown, though. That shit was awesome. Like, sneaking up and just stabbing yeah. him in the neck. See if we can rob this dude. Head still rolling from the road. You want to see what I can do with this? <laughs> Don't. Don't. I didn't want to do it, dude. I was just trying to rob him, but he pulled a gun. Here we go again. Move. You just 
Don't do this. I fought the savage for this cut. Yeah, you're also about to snitch, bro. Okay, boy. Yeah. Okay, so now we got a little bit of a bounty in Valentine, but. We should be okay. We should be okay, right, guys? I mean, that guy was about to go snitch on me. For what? Teach you better mind your own business, you know what I mean? Bounty hunters uh, remember previous crimes you commit committed. Okay, yeah, whatever. I'm not gonna lie though, that dismemberment mob mod is pretty pretty savage. Here we go. So you think we can get some money from them, but it's a little close to town. So I'm not gonna really be able to run bounties right now just due to the fact that uh just due to the fact that I have a... I mean, I guess I could go pay off my bounty real quick. How much money do I have? Uh, how much? We got 49 bucks. So just for the sake of... I don't mind having a bounty. But I, want, I, I do want to be able to turn in some of these bounties. And if I have a bounty, I can't turn in a bounty, so... Welcome, friend. All right, so yeah, we'll uh, we'll pay bounty. Be a lot easier for you once you're all square. Oh, see, this guy can also give us. Uh, I forgot, I got them. Uh, yeah, let's get a coach robbery. This one's been waiting on you. Let's see, where is it? Right up here. Her whale. Howdy. All right, let's go rob some folk. See, my thing is this, oh, like, why do you got to be a hero? Just give me your stuff, you know? Waltzing through here like you own the place. But the O'Driscoll's got designs on it. What'd you say, brother? You the local hard man, huh? Hey, you looking to get your hide hung? Enough! Ah! 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 Mercy, please! I got ooh, okay. Yo, chat, what's going on here? We're just fucking with all the wrong ones. I don't know how to I don't know how to do the melee combat. I know there's a dodge button, I don't know what it is. I think they teach you how to fight in that in that um in that bar fight mission.
Who let the simpleton out of the asylum? You better watch what you say to me. Yeah, you, you dope. I will bury you! <clears throat> I'm gonna stop you out! <laughs> That is something else. Oh, okay, R. Come on, let's do this. What the, the hell? Dude, whoop my ass. Hey. Hey. Okay, so yeah, so I got I I learned the controls a little bit. Let me try one. We'll try one more fight. Cause I can't be I can't be a tough guy if I don't even know how to fight. So we gotta we gotta get some practice fights and let's go fuck with this dude at the church. You goddamn fool. Excuse me? Keep well away. Just leave me alone. Waste of damn space. I'm done with this, all right? I'm leaving. You're a chump, Harden. Oh, Lord. Oh, don't. No, don't do all no, that. No, don't kill me. Jesus, Fight me. no. No, bro. Stop. Arthur, stop trying to shoot people, dude. Just beat his ass. Don't run from it. Come here. <clears throat> Bitch. I said fight. What the? Oh, no thanks. Uh-uh. No. Somebody, I you should stop now. Hey, now. I saw nothing. Why wouldn't Arthur just punch him, dude? Uh, we're, so we're trying to practice hand-to-hand -hand combat right now. Uh, so if I in the future, if I do want to fight, I'm not just gonna get schooled on. You goddamn maggot! Hey, don't you start with me. Hey, shut it. You ain't gonna be so pretty when I'm done. I'm gonna end you. You're done. Uh, Your days are over, you son of a bitch. A lot of trouble. You had enough? <laughs> You're dead. Waste of my time. Right, we could throw hands. I'm feeling slightly confident in my ability to to throw hands bro, what the fuck are you looking at hey you want to let me see up? that ugly you got mug. It. Uh, god damn it it's <laughs> over <laughs> 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 How did that fit? Tell me. I'll All right, we're beating people's ass, guys. There it is. We're beating people's ass. What? What are you doing? Hardly touched. Hey, you hold up. You better not breathe a word to the law. How about you had your chance? Come on, fool. You're Okay. <laughs>
people waiting to fight. Now nah, I'm just I was trying to learn the hand-to-hand -hand combat because I haven't done much of it before. So I wanted to make sure if I did get in a, in a fight, I could whoop somebody's behind. You know what I mean? If 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 it comes down to that. All right. And honestly, it, it it does take a little bit of uh of getting used to. I mean, the the melee combat's way funner than I thought it was gonna be. I didn't think it was gonna be that fleshed out, but yeah, it feels pretty good. Like I actually want to. You can't help with what you. So the main the main issue though is just. They can. They do they do a good bit of damage. Oh, we have a here. Some oh, do they have brass knuckles? Read about the hunt for the Leviticus Cornwall train robbers. People make it too easy. Like, why are New you patient. staring at me, dude? Welcome. Well, it's really the catalog you want to look at. It's got everything in here. All right. Uh, let's have a look. Let's go ahead and. No, we don't need. I don't see anything like brass. Is there brass knuckles in this game? The more bounty posters that go up, the more people flock to my shop. Plenty of reason for that, Valentine. All right. I don't see him as a weapon that you can purchase, at least right now. Well, all right. This will be here when you need it. Well, I'm sure you'll be back. Careful. We got another bounty right here. Easy now. All right, so we'll try to knock this one out. This one's 75 bucks. We'll be a lot more cautious this time around. Whoa! Yeah. Step right up, Valentine. Step right up. So here we are. Damn, that's actually quite a ride. Am I beating people? I mean, I wasn't. I was just testing out. Uh, we were testing out the melee combat. Use this Lancaster to help us out. What's gotten into your head? Maybe even look for some stagecoaches to rob like that one. Yeah. It, if he stays out of town, I might rob him. Hell yeah. All right. We, doesn't look like he has anything though. But still, we're gonna we're gonna rob him anyway. Oh, shit. Oh, no, you don't. 
You damn fool! Could I please... What have you done? Didn't have to be this way, brother. Just trying to fucking rob you, man. I was just trying to rob him, guys. Alright. Let's see if the stagecoach hat even had any loot in it. Oh, I thought... Can you not even... Did I just kill that guy? Oh, hold on. What was that? Did I just kill that guy for no reason? Okay, boy. Let's go. Yo, what's up with these witnesses, man? He, he didn't get suspicious. I was trying to... I can't believe it. Whoa! Guess I have no choice. I'll kill you! Next one goes in the back of the head! Yeah! Yo, it's dangerous out here, guys. It is dangerous out here. You can't even... It's just one witness after another, dude. I'm, I'm, I'm trying to... Guys, listen, I'm an amateur robber, okay? We're, 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 we're breaking into the industry right now. All right? There's going to be some kinks... Trying, I'm trying to break into this life of being a savage. And there's so many other people that have been living there for way longer than I have. <laughs> right, we're going to have to get some more food too, though. Oh, Chris, sorry I missed the super chat, brother. Uh, thank you for all your videos, and uh, they help you a lot. Hey, brother, I appreciate you being here, man. Hope you're having a great day, Chris. Yeah. Yo, that man went flying, chat. What? <laughs> yep. Like, he went flying. Let me see. So what is this one? That's that I... I'll help our dead eye core a little bit. Uh, but yeah, we're gonna have to. We're definitely gonna have to have a bit of food on us. Uh, and I gotta refill my canteen. Or does, let me see. I don't know if he automatically drinks from the canteen. 
snake around here. I can hear it. Yep, the horse is spooked. I'm like, yo, where the hell's my horse going, man? All right, so survival menu. Yep, drink. So you actually have to drink from your can. Oh, there's a little icon down under the mini map uh, that shows how much water you have. So you get three drinks from the canteen, it looks like. All right, so this bounty... No, I'm not going to lie to you guys. I was going to say, it's going to go so much smoother than the last. I highly doubt it, though. Hello, sir. Dustin, thank you for the super chat, brother. Yeah, that horse kick was crazy. I might have to clip that. Unless somebody already did. Yeah. Oh, look at that guy has a deer right there. We had a crash, guys. Yep, <laughs> I got put on punishment. I don't think that was a mod-related crash. Uh, when I was playing Red Dead Redemption um, on my first playthrough, there was just periodically, like, every now and again, we would get a crash here and there. It just happens sometimes. But I, no, I don't, yeah, definitely not the mods. Yeah, we, we had crash issues um, even when I played the game Vanilla. And I want to thank you guys. We got over 950 likes on the stream. That's monstrous. My animal cruelty? What animal cruelty? I was... Okay, listen, listen. I, I I was aimlessly fighting people for you guys know I was I, it was for practice, and then that other guy he wouldn't stop, so I shot his horse, and then uh, yeah man that, that it is what it is. Hey, listen, shooting that horse, though, is what a savage would have done. It's the fastest way to stop him. If I want the cart to stop, I stop what's making the cart move in the first place. Right? That's the savage mindset we need to have. I gotta get rid of that menu again. I always forget how to do this. Um... I don't know how to operate this damn menu, man. So I want to get rid of those little things up in the corner there, but I forgot how to do it.
You guys think, do you think my bounty persisted? Yes, it did. Awesome. I was worried I was gonna uh, lose the bounty. Let me restart it. But yeah, I didn't. It didn't seem like it persisted. By shooting the hurt horse, he basically pulled the emergency brakes. Exactly, Caspi. Hey, I had to do what I had to do. Okay, so I gotta figure out how the hell to work this, because I just messed it up. Does anybody know? Oh, okay, back. Got it. Never mind, I figured it out. It's, uh, we'll go, ex I think it was in Extended UI, Window Manager, yep, Window Avatars. Somehow got like something active here that's won't let me move all of a sudden. Like you see my mouse marker on the on the screen. I ac I accidentally activated photo mode, and now I can't like get out of it. Give RDR two. I, I can't that that's the only thing I can't do though is RDR2 online. It's just it's too um it's it's the modders guys. There's there's no avoiding them and then being on live stream, there's no way to uh to get away from it. I'm trying to see figure out if there's like a button I pushed. That's what I try to do. I try to leave the game. I'll try to leave the game, come back in, see if it fixes it. That was a really good screenshot, though. I'm not going to lie. We did play online, but the problem is because I'm live streaming, um, and it's such a big thing, the, the chances of somebody who mods the game seeing me is obviously very 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 high and even the last time we played we got trolled by a modder um and there's no way to prevent them from mess like there, it's impossible there's nothing i can do um we so we were just at the mercy of modders at that point uh at least in gta i can do something about it and that one we, we there's just nothing you can do guys so um yeah i had to i had to just scrap it it's just not not possible
Yeah, the, the, they had. And I mean, people are like, "Oh, there's ways to work around it and stuff like that." But if I wanted to play with other people, like, it, I feel like it would be a lot for us to try to avoid, like, you know, a lot of stuff hoops to jump through, um, in order to make it work. So it's like, it's like it was really bad. You know what I mean? But like I said, uh, there there was it was possible for us to play GTA because I was able to avoid the hackers and stuff. But yeah, in this game, there's just there's nothing you could do. There we go. Yeah, I just had to restart then. All right, beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. So I'm not gonna lie, guys. We've been getting absolutely erased by people. <laughs> it's been pretty bad, man. Can you just rob people? Like I thought, I thought like when I would rob people, people would be more willing to just like give me their stuff. But no joke, people are really quick to pull a gun out. There we go. Horse any loot on it. My horse up and died on me, twisted my ankle something fierce. Think you could give me a ride? Ah! Ah! What's wrong with you? I was trying to rob Yo, can you not rob people? Damn it, lady, why are you making me do this? Uh, oh, hell. Just get me out of here. So, uh, oh, she just punched me in my shit. I was trying to listen, guys. Listen. I was trying to aim the gun at her, and you know how when you aim the gun at him, you get the, like, the rob, you get the, the rob thing? I didn't get the rob thing. She just started running. So, that happened. Yeah. <laughs> Scream 1897. <laughs> All right, here we go, guys. Here we go. Here we go. Damn, that's a lot of guys. I actually think I have a longer range. Yep. Rifle here that we can put to work. Not a whole lot of cover here. Really, Arthur, don't bust your ass, dude. Not far now. I want, a, I want a good point to engage these guys from. Could try to use the bow and arrow and be quiet, but...
Get dark out. It's gonna be tough. Oh shit, they don't really, yeah, they don't have any clue where the fuck I am. Stamina's out. Let's relax for a sec. Yo, the bow is so good. I did not... Yeah, I've never really used my bow in the previous playthrough against people. So we got the one guy who ran up that way. Only thing is, I don't know if that was our target. I think it might have actually been our target. That was our target. Got it. Keep moving, partner. Looked like a nice revolver on the ground there. I might actually swap mine out for that. Now there's a weight mechanic also. So let me see, what gun is this? Warren Schofield. So I'm actually, I'll swap out my uh, cattleman. Brooks Schofield. So I wonder if you store your weapons. Yep, so when you store your weapons, it actually uh, takes the weight off of your body. That's cool. Yep. All right, so we got a target here. I wanted to loot his buddies here. Another bounty hunter? Oh, these other bounty hunters coming after me.
Get the target to the police department. Gotcha. All right, let me loot these bodies real quick. One thing I do like about what uh, about this change, though, is it, it is it, you know we're we're obviously getting schooled, you know, especially in big gunfights, you know we're getting shredded, but it makes it feel a little bit more realistic. Like you know, Arthur's not just this like, like when you got to face like five or six dudes up close, it makes you kind of think twice. Like how do I want to approach this situation because these dudes are realistically like they're going to probably shred me. So you either a you got to be really good. Um, you gotta be really, really good at the game. Or B. Yeah, no, that was a bounty hunter. Um, yeah, there was only the one bounty. And really ha- you know, and really have your shit on point, or choose your fights wisely. But the problem is, when you're doing a savage playthrough, you don't really, like- Picking your fights makes you kind of look kind of weak, doesn't it? Yeah. Oh, loot the house, yo. Good, good. Yeah, I almost walked. Almost. Probably some good stuff in here. HSC, how you doing? I feel like I'm playing Thief all over again, guys. That's a nice spot, man. I have a mod installed that allows me to build my buy and build my own home. So I wonder how that's gonna gonna turn out. I mean, we're pretty broke right now, but one day, guys, one day we're gonna rob enough people. everything I can grab for right now. Should I rob this dude fishing? to me, champ. Watch. See? He was holding out. Well, that robbery worked good, though. That guy actually gave me his money. So we are getting a little tired too. I forgot we're gonna have to, we're gonna eventually have to sleep also.
But we're about to get paid 75 bucks for turning this in right here. I gotta figure out how to do the assassination contracts and stuff like that too, because that'd be pretty interesting. So the reason why I really shot that guy is because we robbed him, but you know, like how are you just gonna rob somebody and then let him go? Like the chances of them going and snitching are so high. Uh, actually, you know what? Let me skin this. We can get some we can get some food right. Oh, it's rotten. Never mind. I forgot that the the corpses they rot after laying around for a while. Are you afraid to show your face? up this next guy too, ain't I? Wasn't no Driscoll, anyways, guys. He was no Driscoll, anyways. <laughs> okay, boy. That man, he rolled by. He just said, "God damn." Shit, I gotta feed my horse too, don't I? I think there's a full-fledged mod where you have to like actually feed and your horse or it'll like die die. I don't have that one installed, but I realize its cores are kind of low. I gotta get a brush. I don't own one. I, I know there's a. I think there's a, mi a mission that gets you the brush uh, when you go to the stables with Hosea. Right, let me see. Horsey, how do I feed you? Oh, I don't have any food to feed my horse. Me? No, Sheriff. Good work, boy. <clears throat> what 
What, do they want me to put the dead body in a cell? Oh no, they want it in the back. It's me. Come on, open up. Here. Now you go keep the people safe. It better all be there. Yeah, yeah. I'll be back to check on you tomorrow. What are you looking at? I, when we found that operation, I've never seen that before, guys. Yeah. That 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 operation that's going on through here. What do you want? This is private. Get lost. Morning, mister. So let me see, I just drop the body here and then go talk to the sheriff. Maybe. He's the one. Real pe. Uh, I, I don't thing. think I could do the bounty missions until I unlock it. All right, so we're gonna have to progress the story a little bit, guys. We're gonna have to progress the story a little bit. Cause I can't even get Don't in the building. No more trouble from you. Me? Ah, oh, no. Sorry, you must have me confused. I ain't got time for this. So now to clean your ass up. Come on, Charles. All right, we're gonna pro progress the story missions here a little bit. <laughs> Arthur! Arthur, come here! Come here! Come over here! I want you to meet our friends! <laughs> Pleased to meet you. Well, ain't you just the toughest Teak Mountain Man? Oh, you be quiet, Anastasia. Anyone can tell this one is a pussy cat. Exactly! Yes, he's a pussy cat. Ain't that so, Arthur? Whatever you say. How much you cost, anyway? Well, ain't that a nice way to talk to a lady? Oh, I didn't know I was talking to a lady. Excuse me. Well, I must say, you got a fine way with the women, amigo. Yeah, regular dandy and a charmer. <laughs> Where's Bill? Oh, man, I dread to think about it. Hey, hey, hey. hey there he is. Watch where you're going. Take it well, easy, Are you about pal. to kiss that guy Take or punch him? Huh? Oh, <laughs> and we have our answer. Come <laughs> 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 you you piece bastard. Oh, come on. We can handle these fools. Who are you, fools, huh? Oh. Tough. All right, hey. boys, that's enough. Come on, Arthur, hit someone. <laughs> you wish you never stepped foot in Valentine's. What the hell is going on down here? Come here, you little greaser. I'm gonna knock you out. Yeah, I get my get the hell off me. Oh, he ain't getting up from that. Arthur, give Javier a hand over there. You want some too, huh? Come on, pretty boy. Pretty boy? You're kidding me. Pretty boy? What you scared of, huh? Come on, yeah. man. Yeah. Yeah, 
so pretty when I'm done. Oh, yeah. Kill him, Tommy! Uh, uh, okay there, Arthur? Yeah, I got this son of a bitch. I beg you, stop. Come, sir. You won the fight already. Surely that's enough. What business is it of yours? <laughs> no business. <clears throat> no business, sir, but please, I beg you. That dude was kind of putting hands on us for a couple seconds there, guys. Making new friends again, I see, Arthur. Look who we found sniffing about. Josiah Trelawney. The very same. <laughs> well, I thought you'd gone to New York. And miss all this glamour. You must be joking. How are you? Well, quite well indeed. I went to Blackwater looking for you gentlemen. You're not very popular there, it seems. Ah, Javier and Charles. I've missed you. And Bill looking as well as can be. Gentlemen, always a pleasure. You're right. We ain't too popular in Blackwater. We left a lot of money there. And young Sean, it seems. Sean, you found him? Yes, I have. He's being held by some bounty hunters, trying to see how much money the government will pay them. I know he's in Blackwater, but there's talk of them moving. Well, if we step foot in Blackwater, uh, ah, well, then we're dead men for sure. There'll be Pinkertons all over the place, but if he's alive, we gotta try. Yeah, of course. It's you they want, Dutch. Always is. Charles, go find out what you can, carefully. Josiah, take Javier. Arthur, go get yourself cleaned up. Join them when you're ready. Well, what about me? Well, exactly. What about you? What does that mean? Oh, Bill, come on. You were filthy, man. Yeah, I wanted to turn, like I said, I wanted to turn in that bounty, but as you guys could see, the uh, inside of the sheriff station is locked right now. I think you gotta do the, uh, you gotta start the sheriff regular bounties before you can actually turn those in. Yeah, we're definitely really, really dirty right now. How much money do I have, though? 35 bucks. Uh, I was... We would have got another 75 from that bounty if I was able to turn it in. Unfortunately, that's not a... It's not something we could do Come right on. now. Try and help people. I, I do all I can manage. Are you doing all you can? Huh? Use your... <coughs> use your strength to help the weak. Oh, it's you. <coughs> well, I'll be damned. What Hello, if I don't sir? want to help people? Well, you're just full of charity, ain't you? <laughs> well, I, I'm just... Trying to help where I can, sir. Or interfere. <clears throat> you you would have killed that man. What I do is none of your damn business, okay? Okay, okay, <coughs> okay, sir. <coughs> <coughs> Come on, please, please, somebody, be generous. Show you care. Come on, please, somebody. I'll say, what if you shoot him now? Give more. Please. Uh, I'm pretty sure that's the tuberculosis guy. Alright, what is this? Bounty wagon shop? I don't even know what that is. What the hell's a bounty wagon? Uh, delivery job there. Yeah, I'm not trying to do no regular jobs right now. We're we're we're, we're too busy stealing. Um, we got what four missions there, and
All right, we'll head back to camp. Like I said, I want to I want to get some of the uh some of the main missions flowing here so we can fully unlock everything. Uh, it's a wagon you can buy to store multiple bodies. Oh, bounty bodies? Yo, that's dope as hell. Yeah. Alright, we're gonna go back to camp. We gotta get changed anyways. Might even grab a nap. Just cause our sleep. See, the one thing I was worried about, about the eating and drinking mod, um, as you guys know, I love survival games, so. Look lively. Easy, well, man. well, I can feel a real kind donation coming from this boy here. Stay right where you are. Get on down here, now. Howdy, friend. There's a tariff round here on anyone who ain't an odd risk. This is your last. Fine. Fine. No oh, one make any dumb moves. Hell, I'm gonna enjoy riding you, tough guy. Hand it over. Wasting my time. Should have just given it to me. I mean, hey, they started this. I finished it, that's it. About as dead as they can get. Made a little bit of money off them. Nothing crazy. Got a super chat? I don't see any. Oh, on the game. I <laughs> got you. <laughs> it does feel good, though, playing without any, like, restrictions on myself. Who goes there? Like, uh... Not having to worry about doing something that might be a little savage and chat being like, oh my god. Like, it's just, it is what it is, you know? Not right now, Jose. Mary Beth. Okay, Tilly. Uh, we're gonna sleep till morning. Oh man, Arthur about to pull a twenty hours sleep. Yeah, my horse has a lot of blood on it from when I carried that body. 
I don't have a brush yet, so I can't I can't clean it. Uh, but that's why we're gonna do some of the early story stuff just so we can get the game rolling. And then uh, I I'm actually gonna change my clothes too. Right. We're gonna change our bandana on there. Careful not to work yourself to death there, Uncle. I was thinking. Yeah, does it pay well? Oh, eventually. So, while the rest of us are busy stealing, killing, lying, fighting to try to survive, you get to think all day. Well, it's a strange world we live in, Arthur Morgan. Hey, you want to head into town? See if we can find anything out? Sure. I got some errands to run. Great. Go check the horses are ready. <sighs> You gonna take the old man into town? You take us too? Well, what you got planned? Nothing. We'll find something for y'all to do. We always do. We're bored out of our minds. Been cooped up here for two weeks now. Karen's about ready to murder Grimshaw. <laughs> well, can Miss Grimshaw spare you? <sighs> can Miss Grimshaw spare you? What's happened to you, Arthur? Three young, healthy women want you to take them a robin. You're worried about house chores. Let's go. Fair enough. You got me. Come on in. <laughs> I can't believe we're going to see civilization. Feels like weeks since we did. Yeah, Valentine. <laughs> Very embodiment of civilization. <laughs> you ladies are going to love it. Sure, you'll see. Real civilized. <laughs> Let's go. All right. You know the way? Yeah. Me and the boys got into a bit of a fight at the saloon there. <laughs> Already? Ooh, so all that talk about how hard you've been working. You mean drinking? <laughs> yeah. Now we were working hard, man. I mean, we were drinking. Oh. I haven't donated any money to the camp yet. Ladies, sing us a song. Crack in her pants. Lumbago. It's very serious. I'm sure he can handle it. Go on. He's an old man. Lumbago, really? You all right there, friend? Oh, hey, you couldn't help me get my other horse back from over there, could you? Sorry, I'm afraid I ain't got the time to be running around after your horses. Well, I just figured I'd ask. I worried this one's gonna bolt on me, too. Tether it first, then. Good luck. I know. What are you doing? I'm gonna let you rob him. I didn't 
Suppose you help that poor man. Full lumbago. It's really serious. It can be deadly. What about you, Arthur? Do I look like I got the energy to waste on charity? That fool can get his own horse. I don't believe you're quite that cold, Mr. Morgan. Oh, I'm colder than you realize. <laughs> I feel bad I didn't rob and kill the bastard. <laughs> Very inspiring, Arthur. Yep. I tried. Is it me or did the cart get real gloomy all of a sudden, chat? The vibes and the vibe is so different. Is this what it's going to be like being? Being savage. that uncle <laughs> oh very funny this looks like a decent little town other people finally look at all that snow on the mountains sure don't want to be back up there you think we should have asked molly to come with us oh no miss o'shea is far too high and mighty now for the likes of us or to do any real work she's a society lady now okay take a good look around ladies See what we got here. Go left here, down the main street. Chairs always on the right. Sure, you can pick up some bounties there, Arthur. Heaven forbid you put your head on the line. <laughs> yeah, well, that's a young man's game. <laughs> Ooh, yes. We can get up to some mischief here, all right. Just remember, keep a low profile. Will you remember that, though, Arthur? Probably not. Let's park up down the end there, near the stables. Yeah, this open world is absolutely mind blowing. What's your issue? Shut up. All right. Here we are, just like I said, the cultural center of civilization. <laughs> Man at his finest. Uncle, what are we doing? Well, we're going to do what any self respecting maniac does put the women to work. <laughs> With pleasure. We'll start at the saloon. Okay, just stay out of trouble and don't get yourselves noticed. Right, I need to get something from the stores. Okay, well, we'll see you at the general store when you're done. Come on, ladies. Imagine we're in Paris. Come on. Imagine Paris and so that's how you see yourself, is it? A maniac? Well, in my youth, I used to be known as the one-shot kid. The one-shot kid. <laughs> okay. I'm not going to ask why. You are a sad man, Arthur Morgan. But I know you love me. Desperately. You're my favorite parasite. No, ringworm's my favorite parasite. You're my second favorite parasite. Very funny. I lied. Ringworm, then rats with the plague, then you. Shut up. This is the place now. Come on. Morning. So, what do you need? Drop a whiskey for a start. Something to pass the time while we're waiting on the women. Yeah. That guy should probably steer clear of the saloon this time. You're looking a bit tired there, Arthur. Why don't you pick up some coffee while we're here? Plenty out on the shelves, but I got more out back. Whiskey's on the top shelf, nearest the door. Wait. Ain't you the fella who had the fight with Tommy outside the saloon? Yeah, that all got a little out of hand, but I didn't swing first. Sure, well, these things happen. And that was some good viewing. Don't reckon folk ever seen Tommy lose a fight before. Well, it's all done now. Okay, if you're done, I'll meet you outside. I won't be too long. All right, hold on. I want to see what we could sell to this guy, too. So I got cigars. Yeah, all this stuff, all the jewels and shit, that all has to get sold to the, uh, the fence. Man, I know what the smell is. <laughs> well, that's a ripe cheese, all right. So, you're actually buying for once? Are you feeling all right? See this? Young folk got no respect for their elders no more. Well, look at this. 
A jaw harp. What is this list of yours? I got a lot to replenish after that god-awful time in the mountains. All done. Thank you kindly. Yo, Uncle actually has a really nice looking gun. Look at that. should do the trick. Yep. That's fine whiskey. That should do us. Let's go wait for them outside. All the best, fellers. Trying to stay. Oh, here's to your good health, sir. <laughs> and to being down here off that mountain. Absolutely. It's a funny world, you know. This time in my career, I pictured myself being married to an heiress. Let me just. I think I got something good. What? What? I snuck into this fancy house, acted like a servant girl, usually works. Someone was saying her sister was taking a trip from New York or someplace. Train full of rich tourists heading to San Denis and then cruising off to Brazil. Okay. A train laden with baggage and passing through a bit of deserted country at night as to get to the docks in time for the tides in some place called Scarlet Meadows. Yeah, I know it. Yeah, yeah, it's right out near New Hanover. <laughs> right, it's real quiet out there. Sounds good. Uh, Where's Tilly and Karen? I think at the hotel. They were picking up some drunken fellas that they was gonna rob. Why? It seemed easy. They have been gone for quite a while. I guess I'll go see if there's any trouble. Oh, there's Tilly over there. That does not look ideal. Excuse me. Get your hands off her. Who are you? A friend of mine. Get the hell off of her, you son of a bitch. Hey. Hey, take it easy. There's no problem here. There will be if you don't get out of here right now. Derek. You're making a big mistake, Tilly Jackson. Just get lost. I ain't doing this with you right now. Go wait with Uncle and Mary Beth. They're across the street. Okay. Thanks, Arthur. It, it wouldn't let me shoot him. I, I, I pushed the button about four times, guys. Look after her. I'm gonna go see about Karen in the hotel. It wouldn't, it wouldn't let me. I, I, I tried. This city back east. Take out these Can I help you, sir? Dollard and Mountains. Yeah, seem to recall hearing mention of that. I'm myself. looking for a girl who came in here earlier with a drunk fella. Mid-twenties, blonde. You'd remember her. Yeah, they're in 2B upstairs. Are you, uh, a friend of his? A friend of hers. No trouble now, please! friend of hers. Get out of here, buddy. I paid. Ain't paid a hitter, you goddamn animal. Come here! Uh. What the hell are you doing here? Trying to play him. Not very well. You okay? Fine. You sure? Yeah. <laughs> nothing. Nothing to worry about. Just me and... But... Stupid bastard. Stupid bastard was boasting about the bank. Bank. Sure, I know small town banks are usually a waste of time, but this is a livestock town. There's lots of cash sometimes. Okay. Keep investigating. I will. I may have 55 cents on them. It wouldn't let me attack him. I was gonna, I was gonna stab him, but it wouldn't let me. I hope uh, everything's okay up there. After you. Everything's fine. Thank you, Arthur. I don't much like being saved, but when I have to be. I understand. You okay? Sure. He only punched uh, me. Arthur punched him a lot harder. Yeah. All right then. Hey, who's that guy over there looking at us? Weren't you in Blackwater a few weeks back? Me? No, sir. Ain't from there. Oh, you were. Well, I definitely saw you with a bunch of fellers. Me? No. 
Impossible. Listen, buddy, come here for a minute. I saw you. Come here. Come on, get. I don't like this. Me neither. Go get the girls home. I'm gonna go have a word with our friend. Be careful, Arthur. Just a word. Yeah. Hey, that's my horse. Just borrowing it. You stay away from me. Get back here right now. Oh my God. <laughs> What's your problem? I didn't mean nothing by it. Honest. Why are you telling lies about me? No, no. I, I, I got it wrong, partner. I got it very wrong. Now please help me up. I ain't never been in black water. Then why are you chasing me? I've got an unfortunate face. Yes, yes, me too. Now please pull me up. Please. What the hell are you doing? Ah! Ah! This guy, we got an unfortunate face, chat. Yep. Go search his body, though. Lemon ring, some gin. Okay. <laughs> yeah. So we're back in free room now, right? Yep. So I can grab another. Okay, so here's I, I believe this is where the bounty hunting actually opens up. And then that will get us set up for any future bounty hunting that we want to do. Hey, what the hell? I just want to get a drink. I'm parched. Brother. I'm too old to get a job, mister. Way too old. Can't we be friends? Get out of here. You're not kind, mister. You're not kind at all. You're gonna be dead here in a second. <laughs> Hurt my soul, guys. I didn't help the veteran. You're goddamn kidding me. Oh yeah, I added a mod for dog companions. I wonder how that works. Let me actually go check out that dog right there. I don't want to hear anything, guys. Hey, boy. Oh, right there. Yep. 
You're now you now have a dog companion who uh, will follow you, help you hunt, and protect you from threats. Make sure you feed it to me. Uh, well, just like that, guys. We got a dog. See? Right. There we go. Well, look here. Maybe this is our man. You a bounty hunter, mister? Maybe. It depends. Well, I'm guessing you're kind of points of county law. Then I don't need to know much more than that. Until I got a reason to. All right. You smell that? This here's a livestock town, mister. Attracts delinquents and reprobates like flies. Now, I'm not a fellow to pass a quick judgment. But I've been around long enough to know you don't hire a saint to catch a sinner. You bring me what I need, and I'll pay you well, and I won't ask no questions. So, what is it you need? Why don't you have a look at that poster on the wall over there? He's a low-down huckster. He's been poisoning folks with his miracle cure from here to Ansburg. Killed more than Landon Ricketts without even pulling a trigger. Fifty bucks? Sick satisfaction out of it. The feller over at the saloon says he thought he saw him by the gorge straight north of here. You think you can bring him in? The money's good. I need him alive, though. I want to make sure the women he witted get compensated before he swings. I'll see what I can do. Well, good luck to you. <laughs> Mr. Pension, thank you for the super chat, Matt. You little doggy. That's an important point. Alive, I got it. Oh, so I can feed him. Let's give him some food. Come on. So right now his name is Blue Tick Coonhound. We're gonna we're gonna rename him to Dog. That's my boy. <laughs> Yeah, there it is. You ready to go hunt down some peeps, dog? You okay, boy? Yeah. Where's my horse? See, the crappy thing is, we got this horse that we stole. Uh, but it doesn't have my weapons on it. Come on. Yeah, that's really cool, man. Yo, why wasn't that in the game baseline? I feel like everybody wants a dog, especially when it comes to, like, hunting and stuff. Like, that's just a little cool feature, you know what I mean? at somebody else yes you all right what, what's up let's see about this hey wait a second stop i ain't playing here. this ain't happening i didn't give me the option to rob him maybe you gotta be on foot to rob him Got a last. Oh, you got mask? Is that what it is? Yeah. Oh, what we got? 
got here? Are you Benedict Albright? Oh, sir? Got a gun, uh, though. Kind of look like him. And I was told he'd be up here. No, uh, not me, sir. It's because I want to buy some medicine. And I heard him. I heard good things. I'll pay in gold if you could help me find him. It's just my mother's real sick. Oh, well, if that's the case, Yo, Arthur got him. It's for a sick woman. I'd be happy to help. <laughs> I'm a healer, you know, a medical man, finest medicine in the state. <laughs> what? Game's over, Mister. Put your hands up. I'm taking you in. Taking me in? What for? Apparently that stuff you're pushing is killing folk. And there's a price on your head. I don't know. It ain't my business. Come on, partner. That's crap. I'm a healer. I got an aura. I speak to spirits. That I'm a scientist. Folks get real angry for no good reason. This, this is a mistake. Keep your hands up, buddy. They only want you for questioning. I have to insist that this is a mistake. Don't be a fool. Oh, Hold on. I'm slipping. Shit. Arthur's strong as hell, man. Oh, 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 you saved me. Now, come on, buddy. Let's make this easy. What, you're taking me in? It's just for question. Oh, hey, you saved my life. Ain't we had enough drama? I, I'd be better off jumping. I, they expressly told me not to kill you. What? Oh, this is about you. <sighs> Don't jump. Oh, 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 what? You can't shoot me. No. Please. I'll take my chance. Come here. Uh, bye, friend. I really do not like you. Dude, last time I did this mission, I believe it was nighttime. It looks so nice though during the day. Swim to the edge. Grab on to something. Get over to the bank. Look out, the rapids. Hold your breath. Got him. I'm only in it for the money. That's even worse. I'm sure it does seem that way. Uh, yeah, we'll be checking Mass Effect again at some point. All right. Take you in. Let's see what he has on him first. We gotta rob him. Now I'm just gonna check your pockets. Oh, you know what I forgot? I'll show you guys after this. Um, something that I can do now. That's it's quite savage, actually. Forgot all about it. Seem to keep blacking out. 
You do seem to keep blacking out. <laughs> My trouble days are behind me. I don't want none of them. <laughs> Sir, this isn't oh, necessary. Man. I'm a medical man, a healer. A healer? A big mistake. Oh, I don't feel very well. I told you to shut up. All right, let's go. Well, who made you judge? <laughs> I'm only in it for the money. Oh, I don't feel well at all. You're a bully, sir. We don't understand you more in that. Oh, my lord. I wasn't expecting you back so soon. Uh, Mrs. Calthorpe was, uh, was just leaving. Sure. Where you want him? I'm selling the back. I'm gonna just drop him here. Just yeah. oh, there's been some terrible mistake. I never did it! Any of it! I thought I told you to shut up, partner. No. No. But I told but you! But nothing! Shut up! And, uh, good luck! It's been real fun. You ain't much of a man. If you ask folks for forgiveness, you remember this, partner! I've already forgotten. Now, sir, um, how much was you offered? Uh, $50. Here. Thank you. Madam. Please, remember what I told you. So now we should be able to just do the missions on our own. Let me see. Now, so there... I need to figure out how to do the... Uh, the contracts, too. Girl... I also uh, turned off the snipers, so that means I can, if, if I want, with Ar 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 with Arthur, we can come down in this area, because generally if you don't, what ends up happening is you just get shot by, like, invisible snipers. Um, so now if we want to go bounty hunting down there with Arthur, we can. All right, let's get up. Yeah, I want to want to test this. Uh... Hey, what's your problem? Hey, thanks for signing up. Get out of my shot. Hey, knock it off. You little maggot. All right, I'm I'm out of here. Unless you want a problem. What? Back off. Run back to mama. Okay, so he was just acting like a tough guy. He didn't actually want that smoke. Hello there. Let me take a look at you, tough guy. Hey, you looking to get your hide hung? You thought twice, huh? Enough! Now stay there! <laughs> Dear Lord! I'm out of here. No, don't! Lord, no! You're coming with me. God. A lot of witnesses. He asked me if I wanted to get my hide hung, so. God damn! Come on, girl. Idiot. Uh, yeah, oh, I do plan shit. on playing playing Payday 2 at some point. Let's see, how does this work? Oh, damn it! 
There we go. Game crashed because uh, I could like hang people with the with the rope, but the lawman came and I was in the middle of a the animation I couldn't get out of, and then the game crashed anyways. <laughs> lawman messed it up, chat. I wanted to test that though. I wanted to see if it worked. It was all just the test. Uh, suck it. Thank you for the super chat, man. Over a thousand. Wow, we already hit over it. We had over a thousand likes, guys. Holy crap! Like I said, I didn't. I didn't know what to do with this playthrough. Um, you know, I want. I wanted to try it. I wanted to see what you guys were gonna think. Like I said, we're barely scratching the surface of this. This game, I have a ton of mods. I even have another mod that I had to wait until after I started Chapter 2 to install. It's one that, like, adds a bunch of bandit hideouts and all these, like, roaming bandits. Um, you can end up, like, if you go in a saloon, there could be a bunch of bandits just, like, partying in a saloon. And then they'll, like, start trouble with you and stuff. There's, like, a whole bunch of scripted events that... Um, that I added, so we're gonna be checking that out. Um, also, there, like I said, there's so much stuff that I've added into the game. On top of the fact that you know we're just gonna be playing this as evil as possible. Uh, but I didn't even realize, yeah, guys, we already hit that four-hour mark too. We should probably end this here, anyways. Um, but thank you, I, I really do appreciate you guys for coming and hanging out and supporting us. Remember, if you guys do want to see more of this, uh, because like I said, I have played this game from start to finish on the channel already. I don't know if this is something that you know a lot of you guys are going to be in the long haul for, so we're just going to keep playing it for as long as you guys are watching it. All right, um, and just kind of enjoying, you know, getting immersed. This eventually, I will be doing some hunting, fish, and stuff like that too, because we're going to have to keep up with eating and drinking, anyways. Uh, but yeah, it's, it's, it's really, really dope guys. I appreciate it though. It really means a lot that so many of you guys came out to show some love to this. Uh, but again, thank you. We're going to have one more stream today. I'm going to go eat dinner though. And then, uh, we'll be back with another stream. So thank you guys. I really appreciate the love and the support. If you haven't on your way out, smash that like button. Uh, if you're new to the channel, consider subscribing. And other than that, you guys have a great rest of your night. If I don't see you in the next stream and for everybody else, hey, I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.